as far as like throwing strikes last year in AAA, and uh, he's been excellent with Worcester early in the season, and uh, he's a lefty with great stuff that he's going to complement, you know, with Joely and, and Bernie, and uh, he's going to help us. You were on the phone when uh, the manager, Jim Tracy, gave him the word. Uh, what was that like? Uh, you know, just listening to it, very emotional. Uh, you know, most of the people knows the story. And, uh, you know, after a bad uh, afternoon, it just kind of like put everything in perspective, right? This guy has been fighting through a lot uh, through his, throughout his career. And, and the fact that now he's a big leaguer, nobody can take that away from him. And he didn't understand it first when you said you're going to Pittsburgh? No, he didn't understand it. He like, Chad was like, hey, are you ready to pitch? You know, how about two innings in Pittsburgh tomorrow? He's like, what? He's like, yeah, two innings for Alex in Pittsburgh. And that's when he realized, oh, shoot, I'm a big leader. <laughs> that's a great story. And I got the glory report from him from Butch Hobson, who was the manager when he came back and gave him a tryout when he got back after leaving baseball for four years. Yeah, I mean, a uh, very likable guy. It's, it's, it's amazing. And like I was telling earlier, we got two guys in that clubhouse that if you are looking for motivation or, or reasons not to quit, you talk to those guys. It's uh, Booz and, and Bernie. Those, I mean, they can write a book, you know, and uh, he's probably a bestseller. I love Bernie. You know, he's just so happy to be here. <laughs> yeah, he's happy and he's uh, pitching with a chip on his shoulder and deservedly so. And, uh, you know, we talked to him when we sent him down, you know, just prove us wrong, you know, and uh, so far he's been doing that. Yeah, have Raphael at shortstop. Do you think that'll be uh, a day-to-day thing, or could it be for several days? I mean, where we at right now, we got to move pieces around, right? And, uh, you know, he's, 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 he's a good shortstop. He's a good center fielder. He's a good second baseman. Uh, we cannot quit on other guys, right? Like we we trust them. It just happens right now that we, we have struggled as a unit defensively. But, Joe, you know, you know I mean, we, we're much better than this, and they know it. Uh, I think uh, it gets to the point that, you know, I kept talking about it, and it's like, you know, why? You know, everybody knows what's going on. They're very, they know what they need to do, and we're going to keep working. Our uh, question of the day comes from uh, John at AH Paints. Knowing that uh, you're from Puerto Rico and the Clemente Museum is here, this is where Roberto starred. Uh, what is his presence like, and what does he mean? to uh, baseball people from Puerto Rico. Uh, back home, it's more than the baseball player. It's uh, the human being and what, you know, what he did for our country. Uh, you know, he, he always envisioned uh, helping our youth, you know, our, our, and then the, the Little League chapters and the whole community. You know, the guy was a Hall of Famer uh, on the field, but a Hall of Famer off the field. And, you know, you talk about Clemente, and I told you last year, and I keep telling you, like, my kids, they know who he is. You know, they know how important he was for us. And uh, when you ask them, hey, who, who used to wear number 21, they know who. They know who. They say Roberto Clemente. Hey, you're a little too young to have known him, but your dad must have my known dad. him as a broadcaster. Yeah, my dad, yeah. And, uh, you know, just listen to his stories. You know, like Manny Moda, he, you know, he was one of my coaches with the Dodgers. And I used to love to sit on the table, have lunch, and tell, hey, Manny, tell me stories about Roberto. And he had a lot of them. You know, uh, the guy was amazing. The guy was amazing today. We were running around today. We went out for our, our daily run. And just to see the Clemente Bridge, you know, it just transport you to Puerto Rico and all the cool, good things that uh, Roberto did. Um, pleasure that I was fortunate enough to uh, interview him sometimes and he was just a very serious guy really took his social responsibilities to heart yeah a proud individual too you know uh, he was proud to be from Puerto Rico and he, he wasn't afraid to express it uh, you know I remember uh, after the World Series you know he asked for a minute to address uh, Puerto Rico and his family in Spanish and national TV and you know how hard that is that it was back in the day and for him to stand up and then ask for a minute to to address that that was amazing it was i remember it well good luck tonight thank you joe all right the sh- williams how to bring color to your life time to see who- new hot tub swim spa sauna or cold plunge from new england spas the home relaxation specialist visit new england spas in natick norwell auburn or soon in warwick online at nespas.com
Tyler Tyler O'Neill on the seven-day IL. He did travel with the team, could be activated, as you heard Cora just say, as soon as Tuesday. Meanwhile, Rafael Devers has a bone bruise on his left knee and is day-to-day not in tonight's lineup. Well, you heard Cora and Joe talking about Roberto Clemente as they are in Pittsburgh tonight, and Joe had a chance to go to the Roberto Clemente Museum today and talk with owner-director Dwayne Reeder. Dwayne, a marvelous tour again, my third time uh, seeing the Clemente Museum, learn something every time, and what you're trying to do is preserve and accentuate the humanitarian side of the great one, as Bob Prince called him. Yeah, the great one. I mean, what a what a perfect title for someone like Roberto Clemente that spent every minute, if he wasn't playing baseball, he was helping people, helping kids, helping anyone who needed help. He would go and, and, and give up his, you know, his personal private time where you think he'd be at home resting because he played so hard and he was constantly beating up his body, but he was out at visiting children's hospitals all around any team that we played that was St. Louis Cardinals. He'd find the children's hospital in St. Louis and that's where he would go. Um, and so just, he gave his whole life and then he fortunately gave up his life and he dies that way. But, uh, what an incredible human being. And I'm just glad that I've got to be a part of this place and learn all about Roberto. Yes. He died on a mercy mission in Nicaragua earthquake victims with supplies. He had a premonition, didn't he? Yeah. He, um, he's pretty much telling all the adults uh, around him, um, in the later 60s, 70s, that he's going to die young in a plane crash in the ocean and his body would never be found. And every time he'd go to sleep to where he quit going to bed at night, he would stay up all night and work on pottery on uh, and paint and do artwork out of driftwood And when he was home in Puerto Rico. And Vera would tell me these stories that he didn't want to go to sleep because if he went to sleep, he dreamt that nightmare dream and would wake up in a, you know, in a sweat. And so he would take these little cat naps during the day. He never wanted to go into that deep sleep. Um, and so sure enough, he's going around. He asked Willie Stargell, um, hey, Willie, help raise my three boys. And Willie said, yo, Roberto, raise your own three boys. And he goes, no, God has a plan for me. I'm not going to live that long. And Vera's going to need some help with the kids. And so he was going around asking a bunch of his friends and family to help Vera when that happens. And I got to meet a bunch of those people before they passed away. So I'm blessed. Amazing story. And you get so many players from Major League players today that visit the museum, they love your wines, a winery here, but uh, they love to hear about Clemente. Yeah, they do. They really do. They come in there. You know, you think a lot of the guys would be, you know, rolling their eyes or walking away from the story, but they all are they're in tune and they want to know and they want to learn. And I honestly think they all want to be go out and be like Roberto when they leave here, which is really cool. I mean, I make them, I make them part of Team 21 and they want to they wanna go out and be like him. And when they touch the bat, 38-ounce bat, uh, good things happen. Very good things. Yeah, they get the Clemente mojo. It's happened 50 times where guys would hit a home run the next day and maybe they're in a slump, you know, and you know how baseball is, right? And the guys, if you can put a little Roberto on their shoulder or just a little twinkle in their eye, you're not, they're all incredible. You know they're perfect athletes, but once in a while they get a little down in a dumper or something. But if you can get Roberto sitting on their shoulder and boom, in the uh, Allegheny River it goes to where I feel bad for Derek Sheldon because sometimes he says, hey, stop letting those visitors touch that Clemente bat. Hopefully the Red Sox players will all come here and touch the bat. Yeah. Uh, what can fans do if they want to visit the museum? Because it's by appointment only. Correct. Um, and it's that way because we want you to hear the story. If you just come in and wander around, you don't get the full story. So we do uh, groups of up to 21. So you can jump in as a single, a double, a foursome. You go online, you book a tour, clementemuseum.com. And uh, we got one going on upstairs right now. And, and uh, we do them all day long and three on Saturdays. And we now do an open house every time the pirates are home on Saturdays. We do an open house. And you just go on and you pick an hour when you want to show up so we can kind of schedule everything out. But it's very easy. Well, it's well worth it. We congratulate you on keeping the spirit of number 21 alive. Dwayne Reeder, thank you so much. Thank you much for having me, Joe. Good to see you. We'll continue in a moment on the Shaw's and Star Market, WEEI Red Sox Network. Call from mom. Answer it. Call silence. Instacart knows nothing gets between you and the game. That's why they make ordering from your couch easy. 
Stock up today and get all your groceries for the week delivered in as fast as 30 minutes without missing a minute of the game. You have 47 new voicemails. Download the app to get free delivery on your first three orders while supplies last. Minimum $10 per order. Additional terms apply. Miller Lite is the light beer brewed for people who love the taste of beer. It's a 96-calorie, 3.2-carb love letter to beer lovers. <sighs> Tastes like Miller time. Celebrate responsibly. 2023 Miller Brewing Company, Milwaukee, Wisconsin Beer. Spring Fest starts now with new savings at Lowe's. Right now, get up to 35% off, plus save an extra $150 on every $1,500 you spend on select major appliances. Discover the new GE Appliances range with removable easy wash oven tray for easy cleaning in your dishwasher. Because Lowe's knows home improvement. Valid 4-1 through 5-1. Savings vary based on purchase amount. Selection varies by location. While supplies last. See Lowe's.com for details. You know that Big Bargain detergent jug is 80% water, right? 80% water? I thought I was getting a better deal because it's so big. If you want a better clean, Tide Pods are only 12% water. The rest is pure, concentrated cleaning ingredients. Ooh, pass me the intercom thingy. Attention shoppers. If you want a real deal, try Tide Pods. Don't pay for water. Pay for clean. If it's got to be clean, it's got to be Tide Pods. Water content based on the Leading Bargain Liquid Detergent. Managing up is exhausting. It's your turn to be the boss. Advance your career with the right degree. As pioneers of online education, UMass Dartmouth Online offers over 20 years of online education experience, one-on-one -on -one faculty support, small class sizes, and professors specifically trained to teach in the online space. Online and continuing education at UMass Dartmouth. You can do this. Take a minute to check your social battery. How's it doing? It's easy to ignore our needs and spread ourselves too thin. Therapy can give you the self-awareness to build a social life that doesn't drain your battery. BetterHelp offers affordable online therapy on a schedule that works for you. Start the process in minutes and switch therapists anytime. Find your social sweet spot with BetterHelp. Visit BetterHelp.com grow today to get 10% off your first month. That's BetterHelp, H-E-L-P dot com slash grow. Who's in for Mohegan? Obviously everyone. It's an invitation that you can't ignore to experience a place that just feels different. Mohegan Sun, a place that welcomes you in, all in. For the flavors, the fun, the unbelievably unforgettable. Because you plus me plus Mohegan equals the best time ever. And what comes next is, well, everything. This is how it feels when you're all in for Mohegan. Mohegan Sun. Visit MoheganSun.com today to start your experience. Get our Spring Fest doorbusters while you can right now at Lowe's. Shop $5 spring cleaning must-haves from Scrub Daddy, Tide Simply, and more. Plus, save over $1,000 on the LG Smart Top Load Laundry Pair. Was $22.98, now $12.96. These limited-time deals are going fast, so shop them in-store and online today. Lowe's No Spring. Lowe's No Savings. Offer valid through 422. Appliances pricing includes all discounts while supplies last. Gain presents a tale of longing and long-lasting scent. Dear love of my life, we were on the 12B bus when I caught a whiff. A scent so fresh, so life-changing, I had to find its source. I didn't know if you were the woman in the pink freshly washed cardigan or the retired mailman next to me, but I knew one of you was my soulmate. Ah, the scent of Gain Flings. Add Gain Scent Beads for an even longer lasting scent. Sox fans, the boys of summer are back, and the future is here. Haas absolutely obliterated that ball. Jaron Duran leading off with a home run. With the free Odyssey app, you can catch every Devers blast with Hall of Fame Joe on the call. Up another opposite field home run for Rappy Devers. Your soundtrack to summer is on Boston Sports Original with every Sox game live on the Odyssey app with WEEI. Download it today. A-U-D-A-C-Y. Live games available for fans in market only. Gresh and Fourier, weekdays 10 to 2. Now back to the Shaw's and Star Market, WEEI Red Sox Radio Network. All right, back here on the Mass Mutual Red Sox pregame show. Talk to Mass Mutual today. Feel comfortable about tomorrow. Red Sox and Pirates playing the first of three from PNC Park tonight. Sox coming in an even 10 and 10 on the season. 
Your socks lineup is brought to you by Herb Chambers. At Herb Chambers, we don't sell cars. We help people buy them. Jaron Duran is in center field, leading off tonight for the Sox, followed by Willier Abreu in left. Rob Refsnyder is in right field, batting third. Then Tristan Casas, the first baseman. Connor Wong behind the plate tonight, bats fifth. Masutaka Yoshida is the DH batting sixth. Bobby Dahlbeck, who has been struggling a bit at the plate, is at third base batting seventh. And Manuel Valdez is the second baseman batting eighth. And Sadon Rafael gets to start at shortstop tonight, batting ninth. Has not brought a whole lot to the plate, has Rafaela, but happy to see him in there at shortstop. Hopefully he can solidify that position defensively tonight and going forward. Uh, that's the lineup for uh, Brian Bayo, who will be making his fifth start of the year. He comes into this one with a 2-1 and one record in a 3.92 ERA. Uh, Pittsburgh counters with Quinn Priester, who's making just his first start of 2024 all right time now for the subaru of new england scoreboard the subaru of new england love spring event is here drive away in a brand new 2024 subaru find your authorized subaru retailer at subaru of new england.com angels and reds first pitch coming up 640 as well white Sox are in philly taking on uh, the phillies white Sox three and 15 to start the year nationals hosting the Astros tonight, Justin Verlander making his first start of the year for Houston. Rays and Yankees from the Bronx tonight. The A's are at the Guardians at 710. Braves taking on the Rangers. Chris Sale on the mound for Atlanta. At 740 tonight will be the Orioles and the Royals. Twins at home to the Tigers at 810. Joe Ryan on the mound opposite Jack Flaherty in that one. Cardinals and Brewers from St. Louis. Blue Jays visiting the San Diego Padres at 940. Mets and Dodgers at 1010 with Yamamoto on the mound for L.A. And the Diamondbacks and Giants, 1015 first pitch. And it's two of Scott Boris's guys lined up together. Jordan Montgomery goes for the D-backs after that long offseason without a deal against Blake Snell, who was off to a terrible start for San Francisco. There was one final from this afternoon. Cubs beat the Marlins 8-3. All right, that's going to do it for us. For our producer, Stiz, I'm Rich Keefe. You've been listening to the Mass Mutual pregame show. Talk to Mass Mutual today. Feel comfortable about tomorrow. Joe and Lou of the call of Red Sox and Pirates coming up next on the Shots and Star Market, WEI Red Sox Network. You've been listening to the Mass Mutual Red Sox pregame show. Proudly brought to you by Mass Mutual. Talk to Mass Mutual today. Feel comfortable about tomorrow. The Red Sox are coming up next on the Shaws and Star Market WEEI Red Sox Radio Network. Miller Lite is the light beer brewed for people who love the taste of beer. It's a 96 calorie, 3.2 carb love letter to beer lovers. Tastes like Miller time. Celebrate responsibly. 2023 Miller Brewing Company, Milwaukee, Wisconsin Beer. Spring Fest starts now with new savings at Lowe's. Right now, get up to 35% off, plus save an extra $150 on every $1,500 you spend on select major appliances. Discover the new GE Appliances range with removable easy wash oven tray for easy cleaning in your dishwasher. Because Lowe's knows home improvement. Valid 4-1 through 5-1. Savings vary based on purchase amount. Selection varies by location. While supplies last. See Lowe's.com for details. Ew. Gotta get rid of this old Backstreet Boys t-shirt. Tell me why. Because it stinks, boys. Tell me why. I've washed it so many times, but the odor won't come out. Tell me why. No, you tell me why I can't get rid of this odor. Have you tried Downy Rinse and Refresh? It doesn't just cover up odors. It helps remove them. Wow, it worked, guys. Yeah. Downy Rinse and Refresh removes more odor in one wash than the leading value detergent in three washes. Find it wherever you buy laundry products. Imagine travel that's unique. A trip that's literally customized just for you with an expert private guide. Kensington Tours makes your dream trip happen. See the world differently. Visit kensingtontours.com today. Take a minute to check your social battery. How's it doing? It's easy to ignore our needs and spread ourselves too thin. Therapy can give you the self-awareness to build a social life that doesn't drain your battery. BetterHelp offers affordable online therapy on a schedule that works for you. Start the process in minutes and switch therapists anytime. Find your social sweet spot with BetterHelp. 
Visit BetterHelp.com slash grow today to get 10% off your first month. That's BetterHelp, H-E-L-P dot com slash grow. Hi, everybody. It's Brian Green from the Commercial Break Podcast. It's likely you've heard of the show if you're directly related to me or you follow our MySpace page. But I'm not here to talk to those three listeners. I'm here to appeal to people who haven't heard the show. Along with my co-host, Kristen Joy Hoadley, we're taking a deeper look at the topics that are affecting our youth today. Like, who are the people who are dating ghosts? Where did all these pickup artists come from? And why doesn't my preacher have a nicer private jet? We understand that these are the issues you really want to get to the bottom of. The Commercial Break is now available on the Odyssey app or wherever you find your podcasts. Add some sizzle to your next special occasion with the Kansas City Steak Company. The most tender, world-class premium steaks delivered right to your door. Get 15% off plus free shipping right now at KansasCitySteaks.com. Use promo code DR15. Get our Spring Fest doorbusters while you can right now at Lowe's. Shop $5 spring cleaning must-haves from Scrub Daddy, Tide Simply, and more. Plus, save over $1,000 on the LG Smart Top Load Laundry Pair. Was $22.98, now $12.96. These limited-time deals are going fast, so shop them in-store and online today. Lowe's No Spring. Lowe's No Savings. Offer valid through 422. Appliances pricing includes all discounts while supplies last. When you use bounce dryer sheets and your clothes look amazing, it's the sheet. Less static in your life? Yeah, it's the sheet. Smelling fresher than ever? It's the sheet. Oh, so soft fabric. Ooh la la. It's the sheet. Less wrinkles on your clothes. You know it's the sheet. Bounce dryer sheets. More freshness, more softness. Less static, less wrinkles. It's the sheet. This is... And the Boston Red Sox are the world champions. Red Sox baseball. And it is good. Shaw's and Star Market, WEEI, Red Sox Radio Network. For the first time in 86 years. The Red Sox on WEEI are brought to you by Shaw's and Star Market, perfecting the art of fresh. Holy cow. 110 Grill, gluten-free dining done right. Arbella, here for baseball fans, here for good. Brought to you by Azek Exteriors. Visit www.azekexteriors.com. Mike's Amazing, the official mayo and mustard of the Boston Red Sox. And it's gone! Sitgo. When you start with Sitgo, you're good to go. Sponsored by DigSafe. Call 811 before you dig or visit digsafe.com. Drains by James. Eastern Massachusetts leader in drain cleaning and pipelining. And that ball is gone into the front row of the monster seats. Herb Chambers. At Herb Chambers, we don't sell cars. We help people buy them. Morgan & Morgan. Injured? Hire Morgan & Morgan. America's largest injury law firm. Cars for kids. Old car giving you problems? Why not donate it? Call 1-877-CARS-4KIDS today. Northern Bank. New England Ford. Ford Trucks. Official truck of the Boston Red Sox. Looking up! Sponsored by Sherwin-Williams. The Sherwin-Williams Pro Plus program helps you manage and grow your paint business. Sponsored by Nissan. At Nissan, we make cars that thrill. Experience the thrill for yourself. Shop NissanUSA.com. Town Fair Tire. Nobody beats Town Fair Tire. Nobody. We're going to drive to left field. There are a couple runs. Way gone. Subaru of New England. Love spring in the all-wheel drive 2024 Subaru Forester. Verizon, the network Boston relies on. Long gone into the monster seats. Now, with all the play-by-play action, here's Joe Castiglione and Lou Merloni. Good evening, everybody. Welcome to beautiful PNC Park in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, home of the Pittsburgh Pirates as we overlook the confluence of the three rivers here. We have about... 10 stories high, and ready to bring Red Sox and Pittsburgh Pirates baseball your way on this Friday evening. And uh, some very sad news to report, Lou, that David McCarty was at Fenway just 10 days ago for the reunion of the 2004 team has passed away very suddenly. Yeah, Dave, um, 11 years in the big leagues, last three years with the Red Sox, 03, 04, 05, played with him in 03, got to know him. Awesome man, um, out of Stanford. Red Sox sent out the release. Sox mourn the loss of former first baseman outfielder Dave McCarty. 
passed away today at the age of 54 due, due to a cardiac event in Oakland, California. Um, and McCarty actually served in Nesson for a couple of years too, right? In 06 and 08, he survived by his wife Monica, two children, Reed and Maxine. So it's, uh, he, he said he was just there opening day. They honored the 04 team and Tim Wakefield and Stacy, Larry Lucchino, and, and here we are 10 days later. And you find out that uh, he, he has passed himself. It's just an awful run we're on. Very, very sad. Uh, he was very happy to be back at Fenway, we understand, uh, 10 days ago for that reunion. And I remember David McCarty uh, pitching early in that season. In fact, it was the home opener. Red Sox were a little short, and he came out of the bullpen and pitched for the Red Sox, which he did a couple of other times in his career. First came up with the Minnesota Twins out of Stanford. Uh, one of the few who batted right and threw left, the first baseman and uh, a very classy, classy guy. My wife uh, wrote, has written many novels. He's got a daughter who studied at Oxford recently, and we certainly mourn the loss of David McCarty. Well, we have what's turned into a better night here. We had a very overcast day, a threat of rain never really did come down. And uh, right now, the sun has popped through as we watch some fans walking across the Roberto Clemente Bridge behind the right center field uh, fence from downtown Pittsburgh across the Allegheny River to this beautiful ballpark, which opened in 2001. Not expecting much of a crowd tonight. If what's here is any indication, <laughs> it could be in the four figures. Yeah, and it's one of the best parks in, in baseball. I mean, it is a beautiful, and we obviously have a beautiful view here of the city as well. Time now for... The National Anthem with the Steubenville A Cappella Choir. Steubenville, Ohio, located about 50 miles from here. Tonight's anthem brought to you by buildsubmarines.com where you'll find stable, sustaining, skilled trade carriers or careers rather helping bring the next generation of U.S. submarines to life. We build giants because it takes one to build one. The Steubenville Acapella Choir performing and now time for the starting lineups. The Morgan & Morgan starting lineups brought to you by America's largest injury law firm. So Lou uh, Let's run down who's playing tonight and a different look for the Red Sox lineup. Yeah, 10 and 10 Red Sox come into this one here. Leading off in center field will be Jaron Duran. In left field, batting second will be Willier Abreu. Rob Refschneider will get his first start of the year, just coming off the IL yesterday. He will be in right field, batting third. Tristan Casas will be at first base. Connor Wong bats fifth. He'll be doing the catch in Masataka Yoshida's your designated hitter. Bobby Dahlbeck will bat eighth, seventh rather, at third base. Emmanuel Valdez at second base and batting ninth and playing shortstop today will be Sedan Rafaela. For the Pittsburgh Pirates, comes in here at 11 and 8. The manager Derek Shelton leading off with the electric O'Neill Cruz. He'll be at shortstop. Brian Reynolds, Red Sox killer last year especially. He will be in right field batting second. Get Brian Hayes back off a couple of days with a little sore back. He'll be batting third, playing third base. And Rowdy Telez, speaking of Red Sox killers, he'll be at first base batting fourth. Andrew McCutcheon's your designated hitter. Batting sixth will be Jack Sawinski in left field. Jared Triolo will be at second base batting seventh. Michael A. Taylor 
will be in center field batting eighth. And doing the catching will be Henry Davis. Pitching for the Pirates will be 23-year-old Quinn Priester. Recently called up. Marco Gonzalez kind of going on the IL. They brought him up from AAA where he went 1-1 one one with a 3.95 ERA. And he will get his first start in the 2024 season here tonight against the Boston Red Sox. Beautiful night here in Pittsburgh. Red Sox, you know, 7-3 and three on the road before that 3-7 and seven homestand. Hoping to continue their winning ways here on the road, Joe. Well, certainly they've been a better road team than a home team. <laughs> it's just amazing. You go 7-3 and three on the West Coast and come back home and to kick the ball around and go 3-7. and 2,500 runs the most in baseball. If you tell us Kansas City has zero unearned runs. Zero unearned runs from Kansas City. The Red Sox, 25 unearned runs, and your relievers have 19 of them, which makes sense because later in the game, the game, I think, speeds up on a lot of guys and where a lot of mistakes are made. We've also seen them made early in games. But, Joe, as you know, at this level, if you can't catch the ball, you're not going to win many games. And that's just the really the way the season has gone here for the Red Sox. Yes, it's been uh, most unfortunate. And now Raphael at shortstop. We asked Alex if this could be a regular thing and really wasn't ready to commit to that. But I think we're going to see more and more of him. Yeah, and I think you get Ref Schneider in there against righties. That's the real question, right? Because you put Hamilton at short and take Ref Schneider out of the game against righties. Now against lefties, if you want to leave him there. You know, it's a question of whether we want Hamilton at short or Abreu in right versus lefties. So I think until... Tyler O'Neill comes back. I think when he comes back, I think it's easy to put Rafael there. There may be some mixing and matching, but I think your manager wants that kid at shortstop as much as possible. Time now for Powering Possibilities, brought to you by Comcast North Central. Where might uh, tonight's power come from? The Pittsburgh Pirates lineup. Well, I mean, Rowdy Telez, this is a guy that, you know, has, uh, has really punished the Red Sox over the years. I think it's 28 career games. 38 career games. He has hit 327 with 14 home runs and 29 RBIs. So Rowdy Telez right there in that middle of the lineup batting third is a guy you got to worry about. Of course, Brian Reynolds is another one. Right? There's another guy that's kind of beat up the Sox. 522, a couple six home runs. Man, 11 RBIs, six career games against the Red Sox. you got two Sox killers in this lineup, Joe. And you know what's a little bit surprising? The Pirates have been down for several years after they had a decent run there going to postseason or around 10 years ago. They are 11-10 and 10 against the Red Sox all time and 7-5 and five against Boston since this park opened in 2001. Yeah, really, last year was kind of the eye-opener at home, if you remember, early on in the year. I believe the Red Sox took two out of three from Baltimore to start this thing, and then you got swept by Pittsburgh, and it kind of came out of nowhere. Of course, Pittsburgh last year getting off to an outstanding start. There's some things here to build on with this club. Of course, they got the kid Paul Skeens down in AAA, tearing it up down there. We'll get more into him maybe a little bit later on. But this ball club's got some things working. They're 11-8. and eight. They just got swept by the Mets in a three-game series, but they're playing really good baseball to start the year, and we'll see if the Red Sox can continue that skid after that three-game sweep here in this series, but if that if that's to happen, they certainly need to catch the ball better than they did at home. So, Red Sox, Pirates, getting ready to get this one underway as the young man, Quinn Priester, throws his last couple of warm-ups. The right. young catcher, Henry Davis, and with that call, as Jaron Duran gets ready to step up to the plate, I turn it over to not just the Red Sox Hall of Famer, but the baseball Hall of Famer, the voice of the Boston Red Sox, Joe Castiglione. Thank you very much, Lou. Great to have you with us here tonight. With an advanced network, cybersecurity solutions, and trusted partnership, Comcast Business powers more businesses than anyone. Restrictions apply. Call or visit ComcastBusiness.com to uh, learn more. Here we go with Jaron Duran to face Quinn Priester, 2019 number one pick for the Pirates. They've got several of them on this roster, including the third baseman, who's number one overall, Cabron Hayes. And uh, Paul Skeens tearing it up in AAA. They expect him here fairly soon. Big power pitcher out of LSU. The first pitch of the ball game is bounced to the shortstop. Six foot seven inch O'Neill, gloves one hand, fires on the move and got him. They go to his right a little bit. 
That was a pretty close play at first base. Duran up there at 301 with a homer and nine RBIs is out 6-3. Oh, Neil Cruz, he moves well out there at shortstop. You know he is 6 Seven, not your prototypical shortstop. Of course, once he catches the ball, it's two, Joe. He's got an absolute cannon across the infield. Yeah, that was a gun, and he needed it. There's a call strike to Abreu, who's only one of his last 15, hitting a 184, 7 of 38. He's in left field tonight, which is the bigger field here. Check swing, and he went around, says the third base umpire on the appeal, Brian O'Nora. Paul Clemens calling the balls and strikes D.J. Rayburn at first. Brandon Miller at second, and veteran Onora, who's from Youngstown, Ohio, not far from here, at third. So, Abreu behind 0-2. He's been playing good defense. Can't say that for everybody, but Abreu has really been very yeah. good. Yeah, he had a nice two-game stretch at home. He's like four for seven, then ever since, it's one for 15. You thought he was trying to kind of finding it. And there's a pitch that misses away. We are very high here, extremely high. Very high. <laughs> And deep behind home plate. The pitch is taken inside and high. Not as high as Washington. Well, 96 from Priester. You know, we just saw him last year in the big leagues. It was 93. Four-seam sinker, but 96 right there out of the gun. It was on the I.L. just off tonight. Fouled to the backstop. Did a rehab at Indianapolis. Went to one and one with a 3.95 ERA. Three and three last year with a high ERA, but it was because of a couple of bad starts. One in particular, grounded foul to the backstop. Yeah, you've seen a good change up here too. It's it's kind of firm. It's like 89, 90, maybe more of like a little sinker back contact pitch for him. And last year he threw a slider, this bigger breaking ball, but so far down in AAA, that curve ball has really taken over for him. There's a swing and a miss. We're driving to deep right, We're back it goes and gone. Wow, that ball was crushed. He stood there a moment like <laughs> He had struck out, but he hit the ball out of the park toward the river. Well, you mentioned we're a long way away, <laughs> but that was a little slider that he oh. tried to throw down and in, you know, with two strikes to get that swing and miss, but it really just sort of spun, almost looked like a little cutter from Priester, and Abreu puts a swing on it, and he didn't get much movement from Reynolds out there in right field. There wasn't much movement, period. He stood there. Abreu stood there and watched it. He had a right to it because it was crushed. Yeah, this thing was absolutely smoked out of the ballpark Let's here. See how close it came to the river. Well, it was on the sidewalk. There's a foul to the right out of play. 421, Joe. 109 off the bat. That thing left this ballpark, whether it got to the river or not. That was launched. Wow, that was crushed. Here's the pitch, and it's low and away. This is Ref Snyder, 0 for 1, pinch hit yesterday and struck out. Uh, it cleared the right field seats. It appeared to be about, what, 15 rows there. It's 320 down the line. Pitch is swung on and missed as he worked inside. And there's a sidewalk behind it. Usually if it hits that sidewalk, it does bounce into the river. So we'll have to... Get the word on that. The pitch is low and away. It mm. had that good sound to it. And Abreu had a right to watch it. His first home run and his fourth RBI, one nothing Red Sox. The pitch is low and away. Tough get up here for Rob, right? Four for 12 in his rehab assignment. Got a little pinch hit opportunity yesterday against the lefty, but hits in that three hole today against the righty. And he lines one down the right field line, foul. That's off the first base screen, foul ground. He's playing against the right-hander tonight. Yeah, you know, that's one thing about Robbie. You, know, you start him against lefties, but as you know, maybe that second, third time is already a righties in the game. And, and he still gave you competitive at-bats last year in situations like that. There's a ground ball hit to the shortstop, charged by Cruz, throws to first in time. And a top ground ball. Here's Tristan Casas, would have been our first choice to hit it in the river. If anyone can do it. I understand Mo Vaughn was here when this park opened, and he asked if anyone had hit one into the river. He said, I can do it. In the second game here with the Mets, he hit one in the river. <laughs> that doesn't surprise me. There's a ball taken up and away, ball one. It looks like Priester's at sinker sitting about 94, but we saw a four-seamer up at 97. That can... That can play. That's a big jump of velocity from what they saw last year. 
And there's a swing and a drive hit well to left center field. Back toward the warning track by the wall, and it's gone. Opposite field home run, which is very tough to do with this ballpark. Tristan Casas, his fourth home run in the last seven games, and his sixth overall. It's 2-0 Red Sox. By the left fielder, uh, Sawinski kept going back and back and had no chance. That was maybe 10 rows up into the second level here. 413, that one went. And you're right, this thing jets out like left center. There's this little tricky corner at about 410 in left center. It's only 399 to dead center. So that's the deepest part of the ballpark, and Gossis made it look small. Well, the Red Sox now have 26 home runs, second only of the Orioles. Ball one missing here to Wong. He's hitting 342, three homers and eight RBIs. 13 of 38, the pitch to Connor, and he waves it a soft one away, a breaking ball. Well, they've seen this from Priester before. Last year he had 50 innings up here in the big leagues and gave up 12 home runs in just 50 innings. Well, he's got two so far and two-thirds. Pitch is a breaking ball inside. Priester, number one pick out of Grove City High School in Illinois in 2019. Of course, lost the next year, the COVID situation. Three and three last year. The pitch, grounded foul off the catcher's equipment, rolling over by the Red Sox dugout, which is on the first base side here. So now 26 home runs for the Red Sox. I think that's a surprise. Yeah, yeah, it is. I think you'd just like to see more guys on base when they happen. <laughs> a lot yeah. of solo shots. Inside and low. Did he go? No, especially uh, with Raffi not playing a lot. Don't think he's going to be out a few days anyway with that yeah. bone bruise. And O'Neal, he's got seven home runs, like eight RBIs, right? Like he's all solo shots from a lot of people. There's a ground ball bounced again to the shortstop. Cruz has it. Fires high, but pulled down by Telez for the out that retires the side. So the Red Sox get two solo home runs by Abreu and by Casas. Do nothing Red Sox with the Pirates coming to bat on the Shaws and Star Market, WEI Red Sox Network. Spring Fest starts now with new savings at Lowe's. Right now, get up to 35% off, plus save an extra $150 on every $1,500 you spend on select major appliances. Discover the new GE Appliances range with removable easy wash oven tray for easy cleaning in your dishwasher. Because Lowe's knows home improvement. Valid 4-1 through 5-1. Savings vary based on purchase amount. Selection varies by location. While supplies last. See Lowe's.com for details. What's that sound? That's the sound of downy unstoppable scent beads going into your washing machine and giving your clothes freshness that lasts all day long. There it is again. It's like music to your ears or more like music to your nose. That freshness is irresistible. Let's get a downy unstoppable bottle shake. And now a sniff solo. Nice. Get six times longer lasting freshness plus odor protection with Downy Unstoppables in Wash Centipedes. Does your money work hard for you? Earn more with an e-checking account from Westerly Community Credit Union. Get a crazy high interest rate, plus there's no monthly fee, no minimum balances, and you get up to $20 each month in free ATMs. Visit us online at westerlyccu.com slash e-checking or visit one of our branches to open an account today. You're dedicated to play 93.7 WEEI. Now back to Red Sox baseball on WEEI. Ryan Bayo has a two-run lead to protect before he throws a pitch, and his first one will be to O'Neill Cruz, the six foot seven inch shortstop, hitting 234, three homers, six RBIs, the pitch. Foul to the left out of play. Cruz very aggressive and has big time power. He yeah, has a lot of strikeouts this year. He's looking at that eight, 77 at bats, 32 punch outs. That is a lot of swing and miss from Cruz. Over 40%. There's a high fly ball, left center field shallow. Here comes Ref Snyder, and he makes the catch in right center. Get it up. His front foot there, one man down for Brian Reynolds, who is 12 for 23 in his career against the Boston Red Sox with six home runs and 11 RBIs. I mean, that's unbelievable. Well, if you remember last year, I was talking about the Pirates swept you 
early in April. Right. At Fenway. He, he went seven for 12 with two doubles and three homers in that series. Huge reason why he got swept at home, this guy. Bayo delivers, and the left-hand bat, he's a switcher, actually, takes it outside, ball one. Bayo's a true three-pitch guy now. Sinker, changeup, slider, probably in that order. He's had one start against Baltimore. He threw more sliders than change-ups, but... On his last start, there's a strike over the inside edge, though he wasn't at his sharpest against the Angels. Threw a lot of pitches early. He seems to have ditched that the four-seam fastball. Yeah, and why not? It was 20% of the time last year, but it got smoked. Got hit around too much. Ryan Reynolds takes it outside. I mean, that four-seam fastball last year, it was just, they hit 310. They slugged 646 off it. And every time he got hit hard, we kept asking, why even bother throwing it? And there's a check swing strike slider over the inside edge. Change the eye level, maybe? Or... Well, that's the thing. That's the idea, pitch it above the zone with velocity. But he could never do it. And he'd always leave it belt high, letter high, and it got smoked. There it comes, and that's a little bit low. He also got rid of that cutter. Remember last year he tried to throw it a few times. It almost seemed like Corey never liked it because he didn't want to get burned by you know his fourth or fifth best pitch. So he just basically got rid of the two worst pitches he has and settled down with three. And there's ball four. He missed inside. Well, he was ahead, but lost him. 94-mile-an-hour sinker. Missed the strike zone, and here's Cabron Hayes, who's been out with a bad back the last couple of days. The son of Charlie Hayes, former Giants and Yankee third baseman. Charlie Hayes caught the last out in a pop foul in the 1996 World Series against the Braves. And his son, number one pick overall in his year. Bayo deals, and there's a high fly ball right field along the line. Foul ground, first baseman and right fielder chasing, but it's into the stands, no play. We'll check our Friday Farm Report. Kubota Orange Days are here. Check out Kubota's great lineup of zero-turn mowers and subcompact tractors today. In Connecticut, please visit MB Tractor and Equipment in South Windsor. Uh, Rouet Sibley Equipment in New Milford and RS Rentals and Sales in Torrington. First, the pitch coming home to the right-hand batting third baseman, and he takes inside. How about the Marcelo Meyer? 36 at-bats now. He's hit the 333 with a home run at Portland. And Roman Anthony, the center fielder, 278 with two homers. That's in 36 at-bats. So they're progressing well. There's a high foul, first base side out of play. Double A, Lou, that's a big jump, A to double A, isn't it? Yeah, it sure is. It's always the biggest jump, if you ask me. And Kyle Teal's another one that's performing. All three of those guys there. And for those guys, it's about games played. It's about at-bats. You know, you can't climb ladders, you know, by missing games and only playing 60, 70, 80. Play a buck 35, get your A-Bs. Move, move on up. Pitch to... Is grounded to the second baseman. The only play at first base as batter is retired. Hayes grounding it weakly to the second baseman, Valdez, who really had no chance at second. So, 4 3 on the out, two down. It brings up Rowdy Telez, who gave you his numbers against the Red Sox 38 career games, 14 homers, 29 RBIs, 327. This year, Rowdy, 231 with one homer. Big time first baseman. Huge. Pulls that bat flat on his shoulder, and the pitch is in there for a strike. Most of those numbers came in a Toronto uniform. Yeah, Teal, the catcher at Portland, uh, 281 and 32 at bats with a homer, five RBIs. 341 so far in his brief minor league career. Pitch. Ground ball nubbed off the end of the bat to the shortstop. Bobbled and bobbled again and dropped by Raphael. Another Red Sox error. Seemed to have a lot of spin on it. And he went slightly to his right, popped out of the glove, and then he went to pick it up and dropped it again. Yeah, you're right. He's out in front of this changeup, so he kind of hits a little cue shot to Raphael, and I think he just takes his eye off of it. It's not like you got to worry about Telez too much running down that line, but... This is going to happen with Rafaela. You know, he's been pretty much playing dead center field, all camp, all everything. So the transition is not going to be perfect. I think they've realized that. 
There's some issues with David Hamilton there as well. But I think the confidence is that over time, if he stays there, you will start to see a confident say Don Raphael play a high-level shortstop. A big hand here for Andrew McCutcheon, the crowd favorite, 37 years old, former National League most valuable player. Came back to Pittsburgh last year after playing here from 09 through 17 and moved on to the Giants, Yankees, and Phillies in Milwaukee. Right-hand batter. Two, two, one homer, hitting 209. And he yeah. takes a strike. And McCutcheon's really the only guy in this team. This team does not hit sinkers very well at all, but he does. Five for 13 on him in the year. He likes the ball down. See his hands low, the whole approach. He can elevate, which is what he did right there. You can get him. Hey, O'Dales. And he waves and misses at a changeup away. Yeah. McCutcheon behind 0 and 2. Andrew McCutcheon has hit exactly 300 Major League home runs. Not a big guy, the pitch. Strike called over the outside corner. Got him looking at that same pitch, a change up away. And that retires the side, so Bayo works around the E6. After one, two, nothing Red Sox in the Shaw's and Star Market, WEEI Red Sox Network. Spring Fest starts now with new savings at Lowe's. Right now, get up to 35% off, plus save an extra $150 on every $1,500 you spend on select major appliances. Discover the new GE Appliances range with removable easy wash oven tray for easy cleaning in your dishwasher. Because Lowe's knows home improvement. Valid 4-1 through 5-1. Savings vary based on purchase amount. Selection varies by location. While supplies last, see Lowe's.com for details. At Marshall Building and Remodeling, we care about your home because we care about the life you live in it. Why do we do what we do? It's simple. The people. We've raised the standard for what you can expect during a roofing, siding, and window project because you deserve more. More communication, more options, more time spent on the important things in life instead of worrying about home maintenance. So when it comes to your next roofing, siding, or window project, expect more. Get more with Marshall. Call today or visit marshallbr.com to schedule your free estimate. When it comes to your home, we know there are plenty of reasons to protect what's inside. Your family, your photographs, your peace of mind after a long day. At Marshall, we know that protection starts on the outside. We specialize in roofing, siding, and window installations, so we can be sure these critical pieces work well together for long-lasting beauty. Plus, with our easy payment options, investing in your home is more affordable than you may think. So when it comes to your home, protect what's inside with Marshall, your local roofing, siding, and window people. Take Boston sports with you wherever you go. Download the Odyssey app. Now, back to Red Sox baseball on WEEI. Yoshida takes pitch too low. Ball one, a curveball missing as we go to the second inning. Massa hitting 215 with one homer, eight RBIs. Hitless in his last 11 trips. He's the DH, and he takes it high. Ball two. Pirates wearing their bright yellow jerseys with the black pants. PGH across the chest on the jersey. The City Connect type uniforms. There's a strike over the inside edge. There are the yellow caps. Quinn Priester making his first start of the year. Recently off the injured list. The pitch. Swing and a ground ball off the pitcher's glove. Goes to the shortstop. Scoop nicely. The throw is not in time. Massa beat it. It was headed for center field. It bounced off the pitcher. And went to O'Neill, who had to go to his right to grab it. And despite the strong arm, could not get it over there in time. The Red Sox have their third hit. Yeah, Cruz has to go to his right. It is kind of slowly hit off of it and kind of chooses the whole, like, you know, quick release more than getting something on it. And Yoshida actually beats this one out. He had to work for that one. Here's Dahlbuck still looking for that first hit. Low and away ball one. He's 0 for 19. And... Dating back to last year, has gone over 33. Yeah, and the issue too was over 19 with 12 Ks. You know, I think he's got 21 strikeouts dating back to that over 33. It's about the contact with him. It's usually he had a decent spring training. The pitch swing and a miss at a high fastball. He yeah, always does. Right, spring training goes on a Triple A and rakes yeah. too. It's just I don't know if it's a. Obviously the competition's a little bit different. Obviously a step up, but. Not able to just relax and, and, and swing it like he has in other areas. 
There's a swing and a drive to right field. Back goes the right fielder toward the fence, and it's over his head. It bangs low off the wall. Getting away from the right fielder, Reynolds. Here comes Masataka to the plate. The throw, a chance to get him. He's out by a mile. Oh, with nobody out. He didn't get uh, from third to home very quickly. Dahlbach hit a line drive. Reynolds went back, was over his head, hit off the base of the wall. So he breaks the 0 for 19 and 0 for 33 this year. And it's a strong throw, and he was tagged out. And he was in the left right-hand batter's box when he got tagged. Yeah, and Yoshida wasn't bad base running, kind of just gliding towards second base, making sure that once it did, he took off. It's just you know, with nobody out. I think if Huddy had that one back, Kyle Hudson at third base, he'd probably like to hold him and have that second and third and nobody out. Maybe get a little excited for Dahlbeck getting his first knock. But Ball one to Valdez, the pitch. And that's up and in. I mean, that had to feel good for Dahlbeck, kind of breaking that ski. Talking about 0 for 33. But, again, this wasn't bang, bang. You know, with two outs, you may want to send him on a chance like that to make the perfect relay. But... They had Masa easy at home. There's the delivery, and it's over the inside edge. A call strike. And Manuel has eight hits, batting 154 with two homers. As he hits in the Morgan and Morgan batting order. Brought to you by America's largest injury law firm. Reister deals, and there's a high pop-up foul. Third base side into the stands. Well, it's filled up a little bit more, probably somewhere between 10 and 15,000 here tonight. Come a decent night. Yeah, nice night, not too cold. Beautiful ballpark, teams you know, 11 and 8. Let's see a little a few more people here. They haven't even played that many games at home. They only played five. Yeah, three and two here, but they came off a tough trip. They got swept by the Mets in the most recent series, the pitch. Ground ball stabbed by the pitcher. They got the runner going to third. It's dropped by... The third baseman, Hayes, on the throw, and everybody's safe. The Red Sox get a break. Well, Dahlbach was going to be out. Yeah, that was going to really set up for just a bad base running inning, right? Yeah. You get a guy thrown out at home with nobody out, and then Dahlbach doesn't wait for this ball to get by the pitcher. He takes off on contact and was dead at third base just to throw one off of Hayes' glove. So you get a little bit of a break. Still trying to make up for that first one. And really, you um, know, you play it back at second and third, runners hold. Yeah, a bit one out. Here's Raffaello, who's having trouble making contact. Here's the pitch, and he takes a strike. Sinker at 92. Down to 161, looking for his first homer. He's knocked in six. Two of his last 28. With too many strikeouts mixed in. Runners lead at first and third. The pitch. In there for a strike. This would be a giant squander if the Red Sox don't get at least one here. Yeah, you need contact here. You mentioned it, 19 strikeouts here and 62 of bats here for Rafaela. And you got to you know, put the ball in play. He's got some good speed. So even if it's slowly hitting the ground, he should be able to beat that out, get this run in. But you got to get a run out of this inning, given how it's all unfolded. Infield is back. They'll shoot for two, but he's a hard guy to double. 0-2. And he hits one up the middle. Diving stab by the second baseman. Clips to the shortstop out. No relay to first. And a run scores. Very nice play by Triolo, the second baseman. He was actually just to the left of second base. He went diving on the dirt and flipped from the ground over to Cruz. He flipped with a glove. Cruz barehanded it. Stepped on second, but saw he had no chance at first. So Raffaele gets his seventh RBI. It's 3-0 Red Sox. Yeah, this kid Triolo at second base. Already four defensive runs saved on the year, and that was beautiful range. Run scored, but unbelievable play. Durant takes it up and in ball one. A lot of loud contact so far against Quinn Priester. Right-hand pitcher, second year, not technically a rookie. He's ready. And a throw to first runner standing safely. The catcher is Henry Davis, another number one pick overall. See, they've got uh, at least three number one picks in the lineup. 
But that's what happens when you finish poorly. Runner goes, pitch foul to the left out of play. Yeah, Davis was, he was 1-1, 2021. Remember all the talk about him, that catcher? He's out of the University of Louisville. And for good reason. He's kind of an all-around guy. Maybe not off to the best hitting start here, but good behind the dish. One eight seven pop time, which is kind of in that elite yeah. area. If you steal this bag, you better do it off the pitcher. Decent lead for Raffaella. The pitch, he goes again. It's taken low. Here's the throw, a gun, but he dives, and he's safe. He beat it. Very strong throw. It was a little bit high, but even a perfect throw down lower to Cruz would not have had him, I don't think. Great jump. Talking about got to get it off the pitcher, Priester, because this kid Davis can throw. And it was a good throw, but a better jump by Raffaella and just speed beat him. So the Red Sox have a man at second base. Raffaella now two for two in steals. Two for four, that is. He's been caught twice. There was a pickoff in there. The 2-1, Duran swings, grounds it to the second baseman. Triolo has it and throws to first. That retires the side. The Red Sox do get one run. Could have been more. But after one and a half, it is 3-0 Red Sox on the Shaws in Star Market. WEEI Red Sox Network. Spring Fest starts now with new savings at Lowe's. Right now, get up to 35% off, plus save an extra $150 on every $1,500 you spend on select major appliances. Discover the new GE Appliances range with removable easy wash oven tray for easy cleaning in your dishwasher. Because Lowe's knows home improvement. Valid 4-1 through 5-1. Savings vary based on purchase amount. Selection varies by location. While supplies last, see Lowe's.com for details. Managing up is exhausting. It's your turn to be the boss. Advance your career with the right degree. As pioneers of online education, UMass Dartmouth Online offers over 20 years of online education experience, one-on-one -on -one faculty support, small class sizes, and professors specifically trained to teach in the online space. Online and continuing education at UMass Dartmouth. You can do this. Take a minute to check your social battery. How's it doing? It's easy to ignore our needs and spread ourselves too thin. Therapy can give you the self-awareness to build a social life that doesn't drain your battery. BetterHelp offers affordable online therapy on a schedule that works for you. Start the process in minutes and switch therapists anytime. Find your social sweet spot with BetterHelp. Visit BetterHelp.com grow today to get 10% off your first month. That's BetterHelp, H-E-L-P dot com slash grow. Sox fans, the boys of summer are back, and the future is here. Haas has absolutely obliterated that ball. Jared Duran leading off with a home run. With the free Odyssey app, you can catch every Devers blast with Hall of Fame Joe on the call. Up another opposite field home run for Rafi Devers. Your soundtrack to summer is on Boston Sports Original with every Sox game live on the Odyssey app with WEEI. Download it today. A-U-D-A-C-Y. Live games available for fans in market only. More Boston sports opinion, more often. Just download the Odyssey app. Now, back to Red Sox baseball on WEEI. Jack Sawinski takes a call strike, bottom of the second, 3 0 Red Sox. Bayo struck out McCutcheon to end the first. And the first strikeout brought to you by Northern Bank. Get your business in the zone with Northern Bank, member at the IC. That sinks low and away. Change up missing. One and one to the left hand batting Sawinski. Hitting only 176 with two homers. 0 for his last seven. And he checks the swing on a pitch up and away in time. So two balls and a strike. Back-to-back changeups there. That's what he struck McCutcheon out on the pitch. And there's a high drive down the left via line. Slicing foul and into the stands. We take 10 seconds on the Shaws and Star Market. WEEI Red Sox Network. WEEI Studios, 93.7 WEEI FM and HD1, Lawrence, Boston. Always live That's on the Odyssey high. app. That was 96, around shoulder high, so the count full now to Jack Sawinski. Jared Triolo on deck. There's a line drive down the left via line. Trouble if fair. It hits on the track. It rolls into the corner. Karen Gray grabbed by Abreu, but it's an easy stand-up double. Or Sawinski hit that ball very hard. 
So that's their first hit. They left two men in the first inning. It was an error involved. And here's Jared Triolo, the second baseman, 0 for his last eight. He's got one homer and he's hitting 234. Yeah, you know, not an awful pitch. The sinker down the way was probably a little bit up, right? Then you got to get that ball down a little bit more, but still he's going for that strike. Mr. Winsky did a nice job staying on. It didn't roll over on it. Right hand batter. Triolo, the pitch, is inside a little bit high with a slider, ball one. Bell Insurance Foundation dedicated to striking out cancer by supporting the Jimmy Fund for every strikeout from a Red Sox pitcher. Bell Insurance Foundation donates $50 to the Jimmy Fund. Long set by Bayo, the pitch home, and a chopper foul. Over by the third base dog. That went into a team slump, and their manager, Derek Shelton, says he wants the hitters to be more aggressive. Yeah, they, they really struggled in that sweeping of the Mets. 146 they hit as a team in those three games. That's when they lost 9-1, to one, the pitch. That's taken too high. Triello is actually born in uh, Nashua, New Hampshire. He played at the University of Houston. He went to high school in Austin, Texas. Played three years for Houston. And he swings and does not get a pitch, a changeup that disappeared down and away. It's a good changeup. He's got a good one going here tonight. You know, I really liked what Bayo in that first inning. You know, the error from Rafael. He didn't waste any time. Three pitches later, the punch out. You know, picking teammates up. Not letting it snowball. Very important. The pitch. A little bit low. A close one. Another changeup. He's done several changeups. Yeah, he has. He went right back to it. Why not? Triolo kind of sp swung over a changeup that was way down. So this one actually is a better one that Triolo was able to lay off of. Triolo, 26 year old, a right hand batter. 298 last year in 54 games. The pitch. Pop foul, first base side. It's into the stands. Triolo was drafted uh, a compensation pick, so between the first and second rounds in the 2019 draft. Good size second baseman, 6'3", 210. Here it is. And he swings, and it's a soft liner caught by the second baseman, Valdez, at the edge of the outfield grass. Our league leaders who's circling the drain presented by Drains by James, Eastern Masters leader in residential and commercial drain cleaning and pipelining at Drains by James. They give a poop about your pipes. Jose Altuve leading the league in hitting at 388, followed by Stephen Kwan of Cleveland, 354, and then Soto at 352 for the Yankees. This is Michael A. Taylor. Check swing, and he did not go. It's ball one. Taylor came up with the Washington Nationals. Very good defensive outfielder. 1-0 pitch coming. And he takes a breaking ball. He was a special favorite of Brian Daubach, who managed him at several levels in the national system. Yeah, he could play some center field. You know, the Twins brought him in last year because they want Buxton playing center field at all, and he just still plays at a very high level. There's a big outfield here in Pittsburgh, too. Pitch is outside. Ooh. It's 3.20 down the right field line with a wall about 18 feet high. 3.75 to the power alley in deep right. 3.99 to dead center. 4.10 to the little uh, nook out there by the bullpen in left center. 3.78 to straightaway left. The pitch. Swing ground ball. Bounce to the shortstop. Raphael has this one on a big hop. But the strong arm, he throws him out. Runner holding at second base. 3-0 swinging away. From yeah. Taylor. We'll take that. Get a little sinker. And, that, and that's the beauty of the stuff of Brian Bayo. Like 2-0, 3-1. You don't want to leave it up in the zone, too middle of the plate. But you let your movement work for you. 3-0. I would never swing 3-0 against this guy with that sinker that he has. Do the, exactly what he just did. I guess their manager encouraged him to be more aggressive, as we said. Yeah. Maybe too aggressive. Ball one to Henry Davis. The catcher is off to a slow start at the plate. Nine of 52 overall at 173 without a homer. Four RBIs. 
Davis only one of his last 13. Bale from the set delivers home and it's in there for a strike. Three nothing Red Sox. They got first inning home runs from Abreu and Casas. Here's a 1-1 deal. And he swings and fouls it over the screen directly behind the plate and into the stands. I'll tell you one thing, Joe, you feel good about is I think we're safe uh, from any, like, foul balls coming back up to us. Yeah, we are so recessed here I mean, it's, and high. I think, like, a big league fly ball in the infield was still below it. Or above it, I should say. Here's the pitch, and it swung on, grounded up the middle, but the second baseman is there. Valdez backhands, throws from the edge of the outfield grass on the left side and gets him. Now Valdez has been pretty short-handed of late. That was a really nice play by him. Not easy at all. The arm plays him, maybe not play as much, but still he had enough to get it there. Three nothing Red Sox after two in the Shaw's and Star Market, WEEI Red Sox Network. Spring Fest starts now at Lowe's. Right now, get up to 35% off, plus save an extra $150 on every $1,500 you spend on select major appliances, like the GE Profile 2-in-1 Combo Washer and Dryer. In about two hours, you can wash and dry a full load of laundry, all in one machine. Because Lowe's knows home improvement. Valid 4-1 through 5-1. Savings vary based on purchase amount. Selection varies by location. While supplies last, see Lowe's.com for details. Looking to consolidate your debt, lower your interest rate, or need to borrow money? We can help. Borrow up to $50,000 with a personal loan from Westerly Community Credit Union. With our low rates, you can enjoy one monthly payment you can afford. Apply today at westerlyccu.com slash loan. Visit one of our branches located in Wakefield, Westerly, Richmond, or Coventry. Or call 401-596-7000 today. At Marshall Building and Remodeling, we care about your home because we care about the life you live in it. Why do we do what we do? It's simple. The people. We've raised the standard for what you can expect during a roofing, siding, and window project because you deserve more. More communication, more options, more time spent on the important things in life instead of worrying about home maintenance. So when it comes to your next roofing, siding, or window project, expect more. Get more with Marshall. Call today or visit marshallbr.com to schedule your free estimate. You're listening to the Sox on the Shaws and Star Market, WEEI, Red Sox Radio Network. Now, back to the play-by-play -play action. Abreu takes the ball one low. Well, you were Abreu with a 3-2 pitch almost into the river. 421 feet to right field. Cleared the grandstand out there. There's a pitch away, 2 and nothing. He does have big-time power. Good knowledge of the strike zone, the pitch. Is in there for a strike over the inside edge. He had been one for 15, though, before that homer. He yeah. got it all. I think Cora's pretty determined to make sure we can get him in there every day against righties. Ball tipped in and out of the mitt. It's easier to do with Tyler O'Neill out. And that 7 day IL with a concussion. O'Neill would like to be back Tuesday when he's eligible to come off. Of course, concussions doesn't really matter how so called tough you are, right? It doesn't. Doesn't, it's not how it works, but even when O'Neill comes back, he still like to find a way to get him in there every day against righties. 2-2. Two, two. Down and in by his back foot. So again, a 3-2 count. That's the pitch in which he unloaded in the first inning. Here it is. And he swings and bounces this one to first base. Rowdy Telez has it under hands to the pitcher covering for the out. We'll check the Subaru of New England scoreboard as we move along. Subaru of New England Love Spring Event is here. Drive away in a new Subaru. Find your authorized dealer at SubaruofNewEngland.com. Here's Ref Snyder. Rounded to short his first time up. And he takes a breaking ball away for a call strike. Yankees in Tampa Bay are playing in the Bronx tonight. This game started at 6.40, so those games are just underway. Yanks batting in the bottom of the first. No score, low and away. 
Oakland leading Cleveland 1-0 in the first. This afternoon, the Cubs beat Miami 8-3. That one's down. Sinker missing. From Quinn Priester, the young right-hander. Here's the pitch home, and he swings and grounds it to the shortstop. Cruz has it. Throws with even with a bag and gets him. Two quick outs for Casas, who hit a 1-0 pitch out to deep left center field. He really crushed it. They were talking to Tristan today, so you like right field here. It's closer than left. But <laughs> he's got power everywhere. Yeah. Because of that, they're going to make you use the biggest part of the park. And now the first game of the series, you go off on the first at bat, and I try to figure out how to pitch to him. That one misses low, ball one. Two out, nobody on, third inning, three nothing Red Sox. Here it comes, and Tristan swings and does not get a curveball down and away. One ball, one strike, two out. Still sunshine here. Of course, we're near the western edge of the eastern time zone, so we get a little more daylight later. Here it comes. And a foul off to the left. Out of play. That double by Dahlbeck. Another double for diabetes and $50 of the American Diabetes Association brought to you in part by the Massachusetts Health Connector. If you need health insurance, go to mahealthconnector.org. Another foul, one and two remaining the count. Two out, base is empty. And the pitch, swinging another line foul off the screen beyond the third base dugout. And those are 93. It's almost like Tristan sitting soft. 93 down the middle. That was like a late defensive swing. He fouled it down that left field line. Looking for that little hanging curveball again. And he takes a breaking ball just inside. We saw a couple of 96s earlier, but yeah, not so much lately. I felt like the first one we saw was 96 four seam. Ever since, it's been 93, kind of back to where he lives, usually. And another one missing down, so curve. Too low, and it's three and two. Yeah, you get the juices flowing, right? Back here, PNC, you're going to let it eat the first pitch, but eventually you settle into who you are. Here it comes, and it Ooh. almost hit him on the back foot, ball four as it goes to the backstop. Bacasas was behind one and two, but works a walk, and here's Connor Wong, who bounced out 6-3 his first time up. This pitcher trying to retire the side. And retired the side brought to you by Azek Exteriors featuring new Azek bevel and shake siding engineered to deliver classic beauty but without all the maintenance. Go to AzekExteriors.com. Here's the pitch. We ground ball hard but foul past the third base coaching box. Kyle Hudson is stationed. Kyle was a wide receiver at Illinois playing the Rose Bowl. Saw a quarterback taking batting practice today, Russell Wilson. Yeah, really. The new Steeler quarterback. Of course, he played some minor league ball, baseball, the pitch. Ground ball, bounce toward the middle. Diving stab by the second baseman, and he loses the handle, rolls behind him. Everybody's safe. I don't think he had a play anyway. So that'll be an infield hit for Wong. No, he didn't have a play. And even if Koss is running, that's not exactly going to go first to third easily, but... I tell you, this kid, <laughs> Triolo, I mean, he's all over the place yeah, as far as range goes. It's one of the great things about watching the game from up here. You can actually see elite first steps in range on guys. Is that, that the big it. determining factor, the first step? Oh, my God, yeah. Get going right away. Masataka takes outside ball one. Yoshida had a hit toward the shortstop his first time up. Actually, bounced off the pitcher's glove and went to the shortstop, and he beat the play at first. Two on, two out, two on, and a 3 nothing lead. The pitch, a big swing and a miss at a curveball. Right around this year, last time, Joe Yoshida out in Milwaukee had that multiple two-home run, six RBI, and the season sort of took off for him after two months. It was right around this time. 65 ABs. You'd love to see him get going. 
There's a chopper foul over to the on-deck area where Bobby Dahlbeck is stationed. He's got to feel like a weight of the world off his shoulders after getting oh. that first hit. He can't wait to hit again. I mean, you're going all the way back to September, 0 for 33. You finally got your double. You almost couldn't enjoy it because Masa got thrown out the dish. With nobody out, the pitch. Swing and a foul off the end of the bat, grounded to the backstop. You know, this is where, I, you know, I always feel the answers are always the other way. And I feel like if Massa was kind of staying on the ball with a left center approach, he'd be able to hit some of these hangers out of half, you know, that way. But that front shoulder's quick, it pulls, and that's why you see a lot of rollover on pull side. Ground balls hit weakly. One, two. Down and in. This with a changeup. They call it a changeup, 89. Yeah, it's firm. Love What's the have... difference between that and just taking something off your fastball? It's like a BP fastball. Yeah. Ideally, you want about 10 miles an hour off. He's like three, three or four. Pitch is a little low and away. It was a curveball that missed. Has not had good command of his curve, at least in the strike zone. Now that's a big one, too. It gets Casas moving. Right on the base hit. He's not a given to score, but now he gets a little extra jump. 3-2-2 two, two out. Runners go. The payoff pitch is chopped foul by the first base dugout. But it's also very important for both runners to make sure the pitcher goes home first. You're not stealing the base. We saw this happen with Reyes last yeah, week. We did. 3-2-2 two, two outs. He's running and gets picked off by an inside move. Between second and third. The 3-2 is in there, strike three. He got that breaking ball over the plate, and that retires the Sox. So, after two and a half, three nothing Red Sox and the Shaws in Star Market, WEI Red Sox Network. Spring Fest starts now at Lowe's. Right now, get up to 35% off, plus save an extra $150 on every $1,500 you spend on select major appliances, like the GE Profile 2-in-1 Combo Washer and Dryer. In about two hours, you can wash and dry a full load of laundry, all in one machine. Because Lowe's knows home improvement. Valid 4-1 through 5-1. Savings vary based on purchase amount. Selection varies by location. While supplies last, see Lowe's.com for details. Channel your automotive passion into a rewarding career path. Whether you're a seasoned pro or just starting fresh, your local car star has a variety of opportunities to join this elite premier collision repair company. Get your foot on the gas and race to success with a career at Car Star. Explore the endless possibilities and visit carstarjobs.com to learn more about how we drive excellence together. That's carstarjobs.com. Start your journey with us today. At Marshall Building and Remodeling, we're changing the way homeowners think about roofing, siding, and window projects. It doesn't have to be stressful or take weeks of your time. Our process is efficient and stress-free every step of the way. It starts with a free consultation where we discover the best options for your home and budget together. We want to talk with you, not at you. And most of all, we want to listen. At Marshall, we know every roofing, siding, and window project is unique, so we work hard to never lose sight of your vision. It's your project, your terms. Why settle for less? To make smart business decisions, you need deep business insights. This is where artificial intelligence fueled by Micron plays a critical role. High-performance memory and storage solutions feed massive volumes of business data into AI models to identify patterns and trends that can impact your business and provide you with the insights you need to make informed decisions. See how Micron memory and storage innovation is accelerating AI innovation at micron.com forward slash AI. Ask your smart speaker to play 93.7 WEEI. Now back to Red Sox baseball on WEEI. Here's O'Neill Cruz, the six foot seven inch shortstop. First pitch from Bayo. Sinks low and away. Ball one started him off speed at 85. O'Neill at a fly ball to right his first time up. Bayo's allowed one hit, deals, and a strike over the inside edge. That was a leadoff double by. Sawinski in the second. He's walk one, he's fan one. And he pitched around an error by the shortstop. Here's the delivery. That's inside. Two balls and a strike. You know, batting practice, I show you the distance, the exit velocity. Yeah. 
But here they put, during the game, they put up commercials <laughs> in left field. There's a foul down the third base side. It's a beautiful board that, like you said, during BP, they show that launch angle, exit velocity, distance traveled. And then when the hitter leaves, they show on one side the replay and the other side's live. So if you just took BP, you could watch, up, watch yourself up there. Oh, and inside. I, I didn't notice. Did they do that when the Red Sox were batting or oh, just the Pirates? Of course not. <laughs> <laughs> Why would they allow you to watch your swing from that angle? Maybe you could see something that helps out. Yeah. Three and two, and he swings, pops it up. Foul territory, third base side. Dahlbeck with a long run. He just can't reach it. There's a lot of foul ground there beyond the tarp. Actually, there's a lot of fog around behind home plate, too. Yeah, that changeup. He's attacking Cruz with the changeup. I'm a little surprised. Kind of, Cruz, 6 for 13 this year on changeups, right? Everything else, sinkers especially, he struggles with. But that changeup, big man, big swing. If you leave that ball up, right field, short, what, short porch. Cruz from the Dominican Republic, a 3 2. Is a chopper foul. So he got jammed with that pitch. Sinker down and in. Last year, he was hurt early, played in only nine games. His first full year was 22, 87 games, 233 with 17 homers. He's in the leadoff spot, the pitch. Swing and a miss, he waved at a change up, down and away. That ball disappeared. So that's the second punch out. And here's Brian Reynolds who walked his first time up. And that change up is the pitch of choice tonight. Actually throwing it more than he is sinkers right now, but it's been back and forth, sinker change up. He's thrown nine sliders here, 45 pitches, but other than that, change up, slot, sinker split. Switch hitting Reynolds, takes inside, ball one. He was a guy the Pirates locked up with a long-term deal. Reynolds, something they haven't done a lot of in recent years. They're run by Ben Sherrington, former Red Sox GM, low and inside, who... Is the general manager when the Red Sox won the World Series at Boston Strong in 2013. And a very good baseball man. Two all pitch coming. And it's high and away. We walked in the first at bat. I hope they just sort of remember that three game series and just want to stay away from this guy or what, but. He really hasn't been close in two ABs throwing the strikes here. 3-0. This one takes mm. nowhere near the plate. Ball four as he took it up and away. Last year, Reynolds had 24 homers. Actually, the last three years, he's had the 24, 27, and 24 homers. He's been very steady, durable. One on, one out, second walk. Both two Reynolds, and here's Gibran Hayes. Who grounded out 4-3 his first time up. 3-0 Red Sox. We're in the third. Bayo deals. Strike. Got a hard sinker in there at 94 at the knees. Right-hander from the DR works, and the slider's in there for a strike. Nice Sweet. job. Yeah. By oh, Wong, actually bringing that slider back in. We got him that strike. He's from Tomball, Texas. The pitch low and away for a ball. They drafted him out of high school. His dad, Charlie, played 14 years in the major leagues, including 128 games for the Pirates in 1996 before he was traded to the Yankees and then made the last put out in the World Series win over the Braves. Throw to first, runner back standing safely. 15 home runs for Kibron last year. 271. Kibron, actually. Not to be confused with LeBron. <laughs> Here's the pitch, and he pops it up right side. Second baseman Valdez on the outfield grass makes the catch easily. That's the second out, and here's Rowdy Telez, who squibbed one to short. And Rafael bobbled it, and it was charged with an error. The 
So big burly left hand batter. Milwaukee last year. First year with the Bucks. He should do well in this park. Mayo works. Strike over the inside edge with a slider. I feel like Bayo's gotten a little bit better here every outing. It wasn't great against Anaheim, but I thought he was still good. We had to play behind him or two, get into that sixth inning. That's what you're looking for. A little low and away. Let's actually have Cam Boozer here, left-hander. A great story. Played some pro ball, then quit. Worked as a carpenter. He worked on the tiling seals, basically. Swing and a miss. And uh, he went to a tryout for Butch Hobson, managing the Chicago Dog in the Independent League. He was throwing 97. Butch couldn't believe it. I talked to him today about him. From there, Arizona signed him. Got released again, went to back to independent ball. Swing and a miss at a changeup away, and that retires the side. Well, he's got a very good change. And so after three, it's 3 nothing Red Sox on the Shaws and Star Market, WEEI Red Sox Network. Spring Fest starts now at Lowe's. Right now, get up to 35% off, plus save an extra $150 on every $1,500 you spend on select major appliances, like the GE Profile 2-in-1 Combo Washer and Dryer. In about two hours, you can wash and dry a full load of laundry, all in one machine. Because Lowe's knows home improvement. Valid 4-1 through 5-1. Savings vary based on purchase amount. Selection varies by location. While supplies last, see Lowe's.com for details. When it comes to your home, we know there are plenty of reasons to protect what's inside. Your family, your photographs, your peace of mind after a long day. At Marshall, we know that protection starts on the outside. We specialize in roofing, siding, and window installations, so we can be sure these critical pieces work well together for long-lasting beauty. Plus, with our easy payment options, investing in your home is more affordable than you may think. So when it comes to your home, protect what's inside with Marshall, your local roofing, siding, and window people. At Marshall Building and Remodeling, we're changing the way homeowners think about roofing, siding, and window projects. It doesn't have to be stressful or take weeks of your time. Our process is efficient and stress-free every step of the way. It starts with a free consultation where we discover the best options for your home and budget together. We want to talk with you, not at you. And most of all, we want to listen. At Marshall, we know every roofing, siding, and window project is unique, so we work hard to never lose sight of your vision. It's your project, your terms. Why settle for less? Red Sox review after the game on 93.7 WEEI. And they're off to the ballpark, dog park, amusement park, sit, go try clean. Vaseline gets you where you're going, whether you're traveling near or far. When you start with sit, go, you're good to go. Bobby Dahl back at the plate. Strike one, and we turn it over for the play-by-play -play to Lou Merloni. Thanks, Joe. Sitting here at top of the fourth, Red Sox leading this one 3 nothing. Bobby Dahl back takes... On the fastball on the outside half. Ball behind 0 and 2. Dalbeck broken 0 for 33 that dated back to last September with a double in that second inning. Fastball up. Missed by Priester. Priester may not be long for this one. 70 pitches coming into this game, this inning here. Doesn't throw more than 84 in his three starts down in AAA. Here's the 1 2. It's in the dirt. Missed. Bobby now one for 20 this season. That had to feel good. It came in the second inning with Yoshida on first. He was actually thrown out at home. Here's the 2-2 pitch, swing and a miss on the changeup. Good one there from Priester. Dahlbeck is retired to start the fourth. Manuel Valdez. Second baseman, Who grounded out to second base. His first at bat in the second. It's the pitch. Misses with a fastball down and in. Priester now sitting around 92, as we mentioned. Showed 96 in the first, but he's pretty much settled back in here at 92, 93. Here's the 1 0 to Valdez. Swing and a roll over to first base. Telez looks like he's going to handle it himself. He does. And on two pitches, Emmanuel Valdez is retired. 
Fourth inning brought to you by Cars for Kids. Donate your car, help a child today. Schedule your free pickup at 877 Cars for Kids or carsforkids.com. That's cars with a K. Sit down, Rafaela. Steps up with two outs here in the top of the fourth. Here's the pitch, swinging a foul back. Rafaela was robbed in that second inning. Hit a rocket up the middle. Second baseman Jared Triolo ranged out. Was able to flip it to second base. Still got an RBI as he scored Dahlbeck. He's the 0-1. Misses with a fastball. As I mentioned, Priester, three outings down in AAA Indianapolis. Most he had gone was five and two-thirds. Doesn't throw more than 83 pitches. It's a swing off the handle a little bit to third base to Hayes across the diamond. And Rafaela is retired. Quick one through, one, two, three here for Priester in the top of the fourth. We head to the bottom of the fourth. The Red Sox leading this one 3 0. You listen to Red Sox baseball on the Shaw's and Star Market Red Sox Radio Network. Does your money work hard for you? Earn more with an e checking account from Westerly Community Credit Union. Get a crazy high interest rate, plus, there's no monthly fee, no minimum balances, and you get up to $20 each month in free ATMs. Visit us online at westerlyccu.com slash e-checking or visit one of our branches to open an account today. Does your money work hard for you? Earn more with an e-checking account from Westerly Community Credit Union. Get a crazy high interest rate, plus there's no monthly fee, no minimum balances, and you get up to $20 each month in free ATMs. Visit us online at westerlyccu.com slash e-checking or visit one of our branches to open an account today. Channel your automotive passion into a rewarding career path. Whether you're a seasoned pro or just starting fresh, your local car star has a variety of opportunities to join this elite premier collision repair company. Get your foot on the gas and race to success with a career at CarStar. Explore the endless possibilities and visit carstarjobs.com to learn more about how we drive excellence together. That's carstarjobs.com. Start your journey with us today. Spring Fest starts now with new savings at Lowe's. Right now, get up to 35% off, plus save an extra $150 on every $1,500 you spend on select major appliances. Discover the new GE Appliances range with removable easy wash oven tray for easy cleaning in your dishwasher. Because Lowe's knows home improvement. Valid 4-1 through 5-1. Savings vary based on purchase amount. Selection varies by location. While supplies last, see Lowe's.com for details. Ask your smart speaker to play 93.7 WEEI. Now back to Red Sox baseball on WEEI. McCutcheon, Sawinski, and Triolo here in the bottom of the fourth facing Bayo as he misses with a slider up to Andrew McCutcheon, who struck out in the first. Bayo's been impressive. Only one hit, no runs. He's walked a couple. It was Brian Reynolds actually twice. Here's the 1-0 from Bayo. Fly ball to right field. That's going to get... Down that line into the stands. Even that count one and one. Bales have thrown more change-ups here than sinkers in this one. 25 change-ups, 22 sinkers, 13 sliders. He's got some six swing and misses. Three strikeouts here after three. One one from Bayo. The changeup rolled over to third base. Dahlbeck charges it on the run. Throws, has time to get McCutcheon at first base. Nice play by Bobby D. It's one thing about Bob. I know we're talking about the infield defense. Obviously, a guy like Devers is out. But he can play some third base now. It's a really confident style of play over there. And an easy arm that when he gets to it, it's fun to watch him throw baseball, Joe. He's got a great arm. He was a closer at college, Arizona. It's going to bring up Sawinski, who doubled to lead off the second. He was actually stranded right where he was. First pitch from Bayo. His changeup up and away. And Bobby D can play some third. He shifted over to that 5-6 hole now in about the baseline. The 1-0. Swing and a foul straight back. 
Rafael up the middle at short. Valdez at second. Casas is at first. Abreu, Duran, and Reschneider across the outfield, left to right. It's the 1-1. One, one. fastball up just. Missed. Right on top of that box. 64 pitches now for Bayo here. One out in the fourth. Beautiful night here in Pittsburgh for baseball. Here's the 2-1. Shrope that ground ball. Nice play by Valdez. Gets control of it. Throws to first base, and he gets a speedy Sawinski. One thing Emmanuel has done real well, too. He's made the routine plays. This ball was smoked. Hard one hopper. He got a little backhand. Took a step back. A little bit of good throw to first base. Yeah, he appears to have pretty good hands. He does. It's, you know, the range is no secret, right? Like, you, he'll tell you he doesn't have much range. He knows that. And all they're asking him is to catch everything that is hit to him. He's done a much better job of that here this year. Is the two outs. Jared Triolo up at the plate as Bayo misses the first pitch slider away. Triolo fisted a little line drive to Valdez in that second inning's first at bat. The 1 0. There's a sinker filed off to the right. Last year, the Pirates really surprised. They came out of the gate, had that sweep at Fenway. They were in first place till June 13th. Yeah. And reality set in. Yeah. It's, it's part of the learning process for a young team that Derek Shelton has. Here's the 1-1. One, one. Line draw, another bloop to Valdez. He goes back and catches it in shallow center field for a nice running catch by Emmanuel Valdez, and that's going to retire the side. Nice quick one. For Brian Bayo as we head to the fifth, Red Sox still lead this one three to nothing. You listen to Red Sox baseball on the Shaw's in Star Market, Red Sox Radio Network. Take a minute to check your social battery. How's it doing? It's easy to ignore our needs and spread ourselves too thin. Therapy can give you the self-awareness to build a social life that doesn't drain your battery. BetterHelp offers affordable online therapy on a schedule that works for you. Start the process in minutes and switch therapists anytime. Find your social sweet spot with BetterHelp. Visit BetterHelp.com slash grow today to get 10% off your first month. That's BetterHelp, H-E-L-P dot com slash grow. Sox fans, the boys of summer are back, and the future is here. Casas absolutely obliterated that ball. Jaron Duran leading off for the home run. With the free Odyssey app, you can catch every Devers blast with Hall of Fame Joe on the call. Up another opposite field home run for Rafi Devers. Your soundtrack to summer is on Boston Sports Original with every Sox game live on the Odyssey app with WEEI. Download it today. A-U-D-A-C-Y. Live games available for fans in market only. Add some sizzle to your next special occasion with the Kansas City Steak Company. The most tender, world-class premium steaks delivered right to your door. Get 15% off plus free shipping right now at KansasCitySteaks.com. Use promo code DR15. Managing up is exhausting. It's your turn to be the boss. Advance your career with the right degree. As pioneers of online education, UMass Dartmouth Online offers over 20 years of online education experience, one-on-one -on -one faculty support, small class sizes, and professors specifically trained to teach in the online space. Online and continuing education at UMass Dartmouth. You can do this. The Greg Hill Show, weekdays. 5.30 to 10. Now back to the Shaws and Star Market, WEEI, Red Sox, Radio Here Network. Durant steps in here in the top of the fifth. Priester still out there. Top of the order here for the Red Sox. Leading this one 3 nothing here, top of the five, fifth inning. Priester at about 81 pitches on the night. His good sinker down and away to get Duran. Red Sox baseball brought to you by New England Ford dealers. Now during truck month, get a great deal on Ford F-Series, America's best-selling trucks for 47 straight years, an official truck of Boston Red Sox. Here's one old little rollover to Telez. He's going to flip it to Priester, who gets it there in time to retire Jaron Duran. He's 0 for 3 on the night. Telez has been pretty busy over there at first base. Priester doing what he does. Gets a lot of ground balls with that sinking action. It's going to bring up William Abreu here with one out in the fifth. First pitch. Fastball fouled back. William started it off in the first inning. We need a home run to right field and a 3-2 pitch. 421. 109.1 off the bat to give the Sox 
The one nothing lead. Here's the 0-1. Here's the ground ball to gets through the infield in the right field. Telez went for it. Trolio went for it. And ended up sneaking through as William Abreu gets his second hit of the day. And with one out, it brings up Rob Refschneider. A little sinker down and in that he just sort of turns on. Doesn't really smoke it, just kind of in between both guys, diving for that baseball. And Abreu is on board for Rob, who is grounded out twice now to shortstop. Here's the pitch. Swing and a line drive. That's deep to right center field. This thing's going to hit a gap. This thing's got a, It's gone. Rob Refschneider, opposite field, home run. I didn't think it was going to be high enough in that right center corner. 375 at PNC Park. And Rob Refschneider, one day off the IL. He's gone deep for the third time. The Boston Red Sox have a home run in this game. And the Red Sox lead this one now. Five to nothing. Hammering at first pitch, it kept traveling and traveling. And let's see if we get a pitching change here. I think we will. So his first home run came on the first pitch of the at bat. Was a line drive. Home run there for Rob as Derek Shelton's going to come and get Priester. Looks like we're going to head get a pitching change here. We'll tell you who that is. When we come back right after this, you listen to Red Sox Baseball on the WEI Shaws and Star Market Red Sox Radio Network. During this call to the bullpen, it's the perfect time to check out all the great content at buyfordnow.com. Find Ford offers you won't see advertised anywhere else. Search Ford dealer inventory for your dream vehicle. Compare Ford SUVs, trucks, and electric vehicles versus the competition. Calculate your trade-in value and learn about exclusive offers for military and first responders. So, visit BuyFordNow.com and then see your New England Ford dealers. Ask your smart speaker to play 93.7 WEEI. Now, back to Red Sox baseball on WEEI. Well, Rob Refschneider with his first home run of the year. And, of course, I knew the minute I was going to do some play-by-play, -play, Joe, there was going to be a home run by Rob Refschneider. He equaled his home run total <laughs> from last year. And that's going to do it for the young man, Quinn Priester. Looks like it's going to bring on the lefty, Josh Fleming, for the Tampa Bay, I mean, for the Pittsburgh Pirates. Every four back of the Red Sox hit, by the way. Red Sox Radio Network donates $40 to Cars for Kids. Call 877-CARS-FOR-KIDS or go to carsforkids.com to donate your car today. That's Cars with a K. Fleming making his ninth appearance on the year. Eight and two-thirds, get up seven hits. Three runs, two of them earned, three walks, six strikeouts. 1-0 and with a 2.08. ERA. So they go to the lefty. Now the Pirates have another lefty in that bullpen. That would be Araldis Chapman. However, he will not be available today. He was suspended after being ejected in the eighth inning by Edwin Mar Moscoso, the umpire. Apparently, his inappropriate actions were the reason for that. So Araldis Chapman not available. As Fleming gets in here to face Casas. He'll sink her down and in. He'll miss at 91. Casas homered in the first, walked in the third. Here's the 1 0. They'll slide her at 87 miles an hour to get back into the count. Evens it at 1 and 1. The Red Sox playing the long ball here tonight. It's three home runs on the night. It's a 1 1 pitch. This ball is cued down that left field line. That's going to land foul. 20, one two. 27 on the year, so they're second only to the Orioles. Casas takes his time out, as he usually does here once he gets two strikes. Fleming looks in the date with the catcher. Here's the one two. Change up misses down and in. Shots and Star Market presents Norwegian Prime Salmon Fillets. Now on sale. You can get it today for just $8.97 a pound when you use the digital coupon. Shaws and Star Market, the official supermarket of the Red Sox Radio Network. 2 2 pitch from Fleming to Casas is driven to center field. It looks like he's going to be underneath it. Michael A. Taylor. 
under control. He makes the catch, and Casas is retired for the second out. Fleming won 10 games for Tampa Bay, 2021, and spent much of the last couple of years in the minors. Three, two, and five for the Rays, with an ERA of over six and 22. Last year, two and zero, oh, but 4.70 over only 12 games. Yeah, we've seen him a lot. In Tampa Bay, it brings up Connor Wong with two outs here. He goes after that first pitch. It's going to drop in front, or is it? Yes, it is. For a minute, they looked like Brian Reynolds was going to attempt to make a dive and steal a hit. Probably made the right choice and pulled up, and Connor Wong gets his second hit of the game. And with two outs. Sox looking for a little two-out rally here. Masataka Yoshida. This is Fleming with one M, unlike our Will Fleming. Unlike our Will. He's sitting at home right now wondering probably why he's listening to me do play-by-play. -play. <laughs> the first pitch. Oh! The sinker up and in and it hits Yoshida right off of that elbow guard. He sort of shakes that one off. No one got away from Fleming. 90 mile an hour sinker up and in. Massa did everything he could to get out of it. Andy Fox sort of patted in his own elbow like as if he was asking, did I hit you right in the guard? Massa said, yes, it did. Doesn't look like that one's going to hurt too much. So with two outs here, first and second, it's going to bring up Bobby Dahlbeck. That's the first pitch to him, his little change up, up and away. Take 10 seconds on the Shaw's and Star Market, WEI, Red Sox Radio Network. From the WEEI Studios, 93.7 WEEI-FM and HD1, Lawrence, Boston. Always live on the free Odyssey app. The 0-1 little changeup, that misses away to even up the count at 1-1. One one. Dahlbeck broken 0-33 for 33 in the second inning with a double to right center. 1-20 for 20 on the road on the, on the season, but it came back in the fourth and struck out. And here's the pitch, it's ground ball. Hit softly down the third base line. Nice job by Fleming to get off and get Dahlbeck in time at first base. As that is going to do it for the Red Sox. But they do get two on Rob Refschneider's first home run of the year. And head to the bottom of the fifth. Red Sox leading this one 5 to nothing. You listen to Red Sox baseball in the Shaw's to Star Market. WEI Red Sox Radio Network. Channel your automotive passion into a rewarding career path. Whether you're a seasoned pro or just starting fresh, your local car star has a variety of opportunities to join this elite premier collision repair company. Get your foot on the gas and race to success with a career at Car Star. Explore the endless possibilities and visit carstarjobs.com to learn more about how we drive excellence together. That's carstarjobs.com. Start your journey with us today. Take a minute to check your social battery. How's it doing? It's easy to ignore our needs and spread ourselves too thin. Therapy can give you the self-awareness to build a social life that doesn't drain your battery. BetterHelp offers affordable online therapy on a schedule that works for you. Start the process in minutes and switch therapists anytime. Find your social sweet spot with BetterHelp. Visit BetterHelp.com grow today to get 10% off your first month. That's BetterHelp, H-E-L-P dot com slash grow. Mass Mutual knows that finances can lead to uncomfortable conversations. What about that guy who's always trying to get you to invest in his business? His last idea was generating power with electric eels. Oh, what about Uncle Paul? You mean Uncle Audit? How about that coworker who retired early? She's off the grid. So unless you send a carrier pigeon. What about, uh. According to the Financial Educators Council, 39% of Americans don't have someone they can ask for trusted financial guidance. Go to MassMutual.com today. Feel comfortable about tomorrow. Hi, this is Tristan Casas. You're listening to the home of the Red Sox, W-E-E-I. Michael Taylor leading off here in the bottom of the fifth. Brian Bayo back out there, 68 pitches through fours. He files it straight back off the max mask of Paul Clemens, home plate umpire. Bill's been under control here for the most part in this one. Only one hit. Does have a couple of walks, both to Brian Reynolds, who killed them last year, if you remember, back at Fenway Park. Here's the 0-1. Slider, does he hold up? Checks down the first base. Yes, he did, says DJ Rayburn.
Bill comes set with the 1-1 count. Sox leading this one 5 nothing. bottom of the fifth. Here's the pitch. Slider, that's in there for a strike. Today's Sox, Red Sox code word of the game is road trip. Make sure to enter your code word in the member portal today to claim your points. Taylor's going to call a timeout. Try to slow Bayo down a little bit. Here's the one two from Bayo. It's in there for strike three. A beautiful slider down and in. He just froze Michael A. Taylor. Brian Bayo collects his fourth strikeout of the game. A little front door slider that just froze Taylor. We missed the 110th pitch, but if we if I got it on time, it was brought to you by 110 Grill, gluten-free dining done right. 110 Grill is the official partner of the Red Sox radio network. First pitch in there to Henry Davis. He's batting ninth. He is the catcher as the changeup. Fouls it straight back. Davis 0 for 1. He grounded out in that second inning. Real nice play by Valdez. Here's the pitch. It's a good changeup. Swing and a miss. He's got that pitch working. There's no question about it here for Brian Bayo tonight. He's got six swing and misses now on 15 swings from that changeup, does Bayo. Got Davis up head 0 and 2. Here's the pitch slider off the plate. He missed. Good pitch, though, from Bayo. Connor Wong shows him his glove in appreciation for exactly where he wanted it. The one two here to Davis. It's fouled straight back. It's going to get out of play. Beautiful night here at PNC. The view is fantastic. Roberto Clemente Bridge just beyond the center field wall, the Allegheny River. The city on the other side in one of the better ballparks you will see in Major League Baseball right here in Pittsburgh. Here's the one-two from Bayo. Change up, swing and a miss from Davis. Brian Bayo now is rolling. That is his fifth strikeout of the day. Really good change up working here tonight. Downward action, throwing it righty on right, left, throwing it to lefties, both sides of the plate. Bale looking good here. 76 pitches now, two outs in the fifth. Going to bring up the leadoff hitter, O'Neill Cruz. 95 mile an hour sinker just off the plate for ball one. Cruz 0 for 2 on the day. 6 7 shortstop. You just don't see it often. Kid's an athlete. Change up down. Cruz lays off of it. But he's struggling to. Make some contact. He struck out in the third. That's his 33rd strikeouts in just 79 at-bats this year from O'Neill Cruz. 2-0 from Bayo. Change up. He rolls over just foul down that first baseline. See Tristan Casas going after that ball. That's one thing you've noticed this year from Tristan Casas. At least I have. The range left and right has improved. But last year, with a lot of balls down the line to his left, to his right. That he didn't get to. You knew he's not a finished product defensively, and I think he's worked really hard in the offseason to work on that agility left and right, and he has improved that range, which is good to see. So Neil Cruz, I think, broke a bat, took some time to go get a new one. A 2 1 from Bayo. Here's a slider for a strike. Draws the Star Market presents Norwegian Prime Salmon Fillets now on sale. Get it today, $8.97 a pound when you use the digital coupon. Shaw's and Star Market, the official supermarket of the Red Sox radio network. 2-2 pitch from Bayo to Cruz. Here it is, change up. Dribbled right out in front. Wong jumps all over it. Throws the ball to Casas. That will retire the side. It's 1-2-3 inning from Brian Bayo as we head to the sixth with the Red Sox leading this one 5 nothing. You're listening to the Red Sox Baseball on the WEI Shaw's and Star Market, Red Sox Radio Network. Is this house a good price compared to others in the area? Are prices going up or down? If I don't make an offer right this very moment, will I miss my chance? These are just some of the questions a home buyer might ask. And these are the sorts of questions an agent who is a Realtor can help answer. Because Realtors have the expertise, data, and access to specialty training to help you navigate the process of buying a home. They provide support, guidance, and have your back every step of the way. That's what Realtors do, because that's who we are. 
Realtors are members of the National Association of Realtors. Managing up is exhausting. It's your turn to be the boss. Advance your career with the right degree. As pioneers of online education, UMass Dartmouth Online offers over 20 years of online education experience, one-on-one -on -one faculty support, small class sizes, and professors specifically trained to teach in the online space. Online and continuing education at UMass Dartmouth. You can do this. Take a minute to check your social battery. How's it doing? It's easy to ignore our needs and spread ourselves too thin. Therapy can give you the self-awareness to build a social life that doesn't drain your battery. BetterHelp offers affordable online therapy on a schedule that works for you. Start the process in minutes and switch therapists anytime. Find your social sweet spot with BetterHelp. Visit BetterHelp.com grow today to get 10% off your first month. That's BetterHelp, H-E-L-P dot com slash grow. Take Boston sports with you wherever you go. Download the Odyssey app. Now, back to Red Sox baseball on WEEI. Alonzi Contreras, the new pitcher, misses up and into, and Manuel Valdez, who's bounced into a force and grounded to first. He's also played some fine defense today. Third baseman Brian Hayes in close at third. The pitch is in there for a strike at the knees. Alonzi Contreras last year made his first appearance and got a win at Fenway Park as a starter but didn't fare too well after that. Right-hander for the Dominican, three and seven with a 6.59 ERA. There's a high fly ball center field. Moving back a few steps is Taylor, and that makes the catch at the edge of the track. That ball's really carrying the right center. Mm -hmm. It looked like a well. routine fly ball, but it kept carrying, just like the home run off the batter ref Snyder in the same direction. One down for Raffaella, who bounced into a force, actually robbed of a hit by Triolo, their fine-looking second baseman. He's got good range. Got an RBI in the process and stole second. Last time rounded out 5-3. And he rips this one to left. High and deep. Back toward the warning track. Sawinski at the wall. Tries to climb it, but it's gone. Said Don Raffaella with his first home run of the season. And the Red Sox now take a 6-0 lead. That was a fastball down and in, but well above the knees, and he crushed it. Well, uh, I, I, you know, I think you're starting to see it a little bit rough with Rafael. I know it's a two for 20 slash 28, but even his first at bat, you know, I thought he got robbed of a knock. We've seen him driving the ball, barreling the baseball more, driving the ball to center field, driving the ball to right center, and that and there he got a good pitch to drive, and he did not miss it. Hitting off the six with a homer call strike. Last year he had two home runs, so his third major league homer. He got it all. Beautiful swing, slide uppercut. Duran, who's 0 for 3, takes a strike. He's grounded out 6 3, 4 3, and 3 1. But that'll uh, really, I think, boost his confidence. Yeah, that'll help, especially getting robbed in that first inning, even though he got the RBI. But. That will help. And for him, it's just going to be a weekly thing, a monthly thing. Try to be better in May than you are in April and just kind of keep that going. The tough league. Pitch is a check swing. Did he go? No, says the umpire at third. So Red Sox have four homers tonight. They've hit 28 this season. Hmm. Orioles had 30 going into tonight's play. They're Kansas City just underway. Check swing, breaking ball down and in, and that's a ball, two and two. Ref Schneider was not solo. He got three solo shots like we've talked about. They got a lot of solo homers. Ref Schneider was a two-run shot. Duran hits one high on the edge of the outfield grass. The shortstop is under it. O'Neill backpedaling makes the catch for the out. Two down to Contreras. Originally signed by the Yankees, was traded to the Pirates for Jamison Tyone, January of 21. And here's Abreu with a 3-2 pitch almost out of the park. In the first inning, his first of the year, grounded out 3-1, single to right, and scored. And he takes a call strike from Contreras, making his seventh appearance. He's won his only decision. Came in with an ERA of just over three. He's the third Pirate pitcher. Here it is. And there's a high fly left field shallow. Sawinski coming in toward the line. He's under it. 
and makes the catch for the out that retires the side, but the Red Sox get another blast. We go to the bottom of the sixth. Boston on top, 6-0 on the Shaws in Star Market, WEEI Red Sox Network. Spring, is that you? Warmer temps mean new Albert styles. Meet the Superlight Collection, the lightest ever shoes from Allbirds, now in fresh colors. These must-have travel shoes have a lighter-than-air feel and barely their fit that made them the most packable shoes ever. That means more comfort and less baggage. Try the Super Light Tree Runner with a cushy foam midsole and breathable eucalyptus fiber upper. Plus, they're comfy right out of the box. So, what can you do in a Super Light shoe? What can't you do is the better question. And because they're super packable, the real question is, where are you taking them? Experience how Allbirds redefines comfort. Visit Allbirds.com and use code SUPER24 for a free pair of socks with a purchase of $48 or more. That's A-L-L-B-I-R-D-S dot com, code SUPER24. If you own a vehicle with less than 200,000 miles and have an auto warranty about to expire or no warranty coverage at all, listen up. CarShield has a low-cost, month-to-month vehicle protection plan that covers more parts than ever. Visit carshield.com slash audio to find out how you could pay almost nothing for covered auto repairs. Drivers who activate this vehicle protection today will also receive free roadside assistance, free towing, and car rental options at no additional cost. Get your free quote today at carshield.com slash audio. That's carshield.com slash audio. Sox fans, the boys of summer are back, and the future is here. Casas absolutely obliterated that ball. Jaron Duran leading off with a home run. With the free Odyssey app, you can catch every Devers blast with Hall of Fame Joe on the call. Up another opposite field home run for Rafi Devers. Your soundtrack to summer is on Boston Sports Original with every Sox game live on the Odyssey app with WEEI. Download it today. A-U-D-A-C-Y. Live games available for fans in market only. More Boston sports opinion, more often. Just download the Odyssey app. Now, back to Red Sox baseball on WEEI. All right, Bayo's been good. Allowed only one hit so far. He's walked two, and here's the man who's walked both times, Ryan Reynolds, taking low ball one. Red Sox very careful with him. 12 for 23 in his career with six homers against Boston. Check the Super New England scoreboard as you move along. The New England... Love spring event is here. Drive away in a brand new Subaru. Swinging strike and a pitch down and in. Find your authorized Subaru retailer at SubaruofNewEngland.com. Cubs beat Miami today 8-3. to The only final of the day game, the pitch. There's a strike. More line pitch over the inside edge with a changeup. And it's a ball and two strikes. Clemens had to think about that one a little bit. He hesitated. He did. <clears throat> Good changeup. Cleveland on top of Oakland at Cleveland, two to one. Red Sox go to Cleveland next. The one two, and he swings and does not get it. Strike three. Another good changeup. This one away. Boy, he's had a really good changeup tonight. Yeah, he has, and an outing that really didn't have a lot of swing and miss in it. Just throwing strikes, getting some easy outs. He's starting to rack them up here now on this changeup last couple of innings. It's Brian Hayes now who's grounded out 4-3 and popped his second. He takes it up and away ball one. With eight swing and misses on 20 swings from that changeup. That's a 40% swing and whiff rate. That's legit. How would you describe how it moves? It just it fades down and away kind of more vertical than anything and just away from that lefty there's one that disappears. This is a slider. He swings and misses. You know, really, a lot of times when you watch him on TV, if there was no radar gun, you wouldn't be sure if it was a changeup or a sinker. I mean, you could judge by the reaction of the hitter, but they both have that same diving down and in action to righties. There's a strike. There's a changeup down and away. Is he throwing 50% changeups? More. Well, I mean, yeah, no, he's, he's, he's at about 43%, but it's just more than his sinker is right now. Sinker's about 33%. One, two, little outside with a slider. He's had a good slider as well. Yeah, he doesn't abandon anything. Like this, 25% sliders, too. So he's it's a true three-pitch mix. This has been his best outing of the season. We were looking for it. Had good rhythm, 2-2. Two, two. Swing and a line foul. First base side out of play. This copyrighted... Broadcast presented by authority of the Boston Red Sox may not be reproduced or retransmitted in any form, and the accounts or descriptions of this game may not be disseminated without the express written consent of WEEI and the Boston Red Sox. 
Another 2-2. Two -two. Strike mm. three call. He got that sinker over the inside corner. You have 98 up there in that 96. pitch? 96. Yeah, 96 on that sinker. Well, he's fan four of the last five hitters. Seven Ks overall. And here's Roddy Telez who reached on an error and struck out. On that the Subaru scoreboard, Yankees in Tampa Bay, no score in the third. Bronx swing and a miss. Mm. Hank Solano, John Sterling is retiring before tomorrow's game. Baltimore and Kansas City, no score in the third. Minnesota leading, actually, no score against Detroit in the first of Minnesota. That's up and away. One ball, one strike. Bayo has walked two, both Reynolds, and struck out seven to pitch. Grounded foul around the batter's box. The only hit was a double by Sawinski, and he hit that ball well down the left field side. Yeah, 95 pitches right now. Look at Bayo's. He threw 107 his last time out against L.A. Yeah, he struggled in that one, but he recovered. Only gave up a couple of runs to pitch. There's a shot on... One hop to short. Raffaella has it. Plenty of time. Wings to first to retire the side. After five and a half, now six full innings. Six full, six nothing Red Sox on the Shaw's and Star Market, WEEI Red Sox Network. Take a minute to check your social battery. How's it doing? It's easy to ignore our needs and spread ourselves too thin. Therapy can give you the self-awareness to build a social life that doesn't drain your battery. BetterHelp offers affordable online therapy on a schedule that works for you. Start the process in minutes and switch therapists anytime. Find your social sweet spot with BetterHelp. Visit BetterHelp.com grow today to get 10% off your first month. That's BetterHelp, H-E-L-P dot com slash grow. Managing up is exhausting. It's your turn to be the boss. Advance your career with the right degree. As pioneers of online education, UMass Dartmouth Online offers over 20 years of online education experience, one-on-one -on -one faculty support, small class sizes, and professors specifically trained to teach in the online space. Online and continuing education at UMass Dartmouth. You can do this. When it's time for your child to go for their driver's license, do you only want them to learn enough to pass the tests or to also gain the experience and confidence that it takes to be a successful driver? Get both with A&M Driving School in Fall River. With A&M, you'll provide your driver with the skills and confidence they need to feel secure behind their first wheel. That means peace of mind for you. Parents, do you need a license? A&M can help with that too. Get on the road to driving success today at a-mdriving.com. Sox fans, the boys of summer are back, and the future is here. Haas has absolutely obliterated that ball. Jared Duran leading off with a home run. With the free Odyssey app, you can catch every Devers blast with Hall of Fame Joe on the call. Another opposite field home run for Rafi Devers. Your soundtrack to summer is on Boston Sports Original with every Sox game live on the Odyssey app with WEEI. Download it today, A-U-D-A-C-Y. Live games available for fans in market only. Take Boston sports with you wherever you go. Download the Odyssey app. Now, back to Red Sox baseball on WEEI. Seventh inning, Rob. Ref Snyder grounds the first pitch, and it's fair. Almost hit the umpire. Rolls down the left field line. Kicks off the side wall. Ref Snyder well on his way to second as a double. First ball swinging. He doubles. First ball swinging in the fifth inning. He homered to deep right center. First of the season after grinding out short to first twice. So he's two for four. Yeah, first pitch swinging on a breaking ball from Contreras. And all these, both hits off right-handers. Yeah, Brian O'Nor showing some flexibility, huh? Yeah, Next he, time I see him, I'm going to have to let him know how impressed I am. First I played uh, football at Austin Town Fitch High School in the Youngstown area. Tristan Casas hit a long home run to left. 400. 12 feet in the first inning, walked and flied to center. And he checks the swing on a high fastball, ball one from Contreras, the righty reliever. What a big boost from Ref Snyder, huh? Coming in here now after being on the IL to start the year. 
probably given the injury of O'Neill, was probably rushed here. They probably wanted to give him another game or two down the minor leagues, but you activate him. You come here tonight, two for four, home run and a double. Swinging well. The pitch is fouled to the backstop. Seventh inning sponsored by Sherwin-Williams. The exclusive Sherwin-Williams Pro Plus program will help you grow and manage your paint business. Looks like Chase Anderson getting loose out in that bullpen. That could be it for Bayo. If it is, it was a gem. Six innings, one hit, two walks, and seven strikeouts on 96 pitches. It's what you're looking for from him. Get that ERA down at 304. Very encouraging. Pitch. Foul to the backstop. That's what they needed, too. And you see, it's interesting that Anderson's coming up here. They haven't announced a starter yet on Sunday. Before the game, Cora almost made it sound like Winkowski, he's met it a yeah. few times, is in the conversation, but he said it so often, I almost feel like Winkowski is starting on Sunday. He's been stretched out a little bit. They give it to him. Chriswell only threw a few innings the other day. So he may be able to, between the two of them, maybe get you five, six innings. But Chase Anderson would have been another option for Sunday. He is now getting ready to come into this game. That's why it's nice to save some of the top bullpen arms tonight. All third base side out of play. What scoring runs allows you to do, Joe? You average three and a half runs at that homestand. You put up a six spot, a seven, eight spot. You can you know, save some of your high leverage guys. You play a lot of close one run, two run games. You start abusing that bullpen and the wrong guys, overusing the wrong guys, the guys you want to use. Score some runs, stretch it out, play with ease a little bit every once in a while. Breaking ball strike over the inside edge. And Costas goes down looking. I didn't think so. Pretty good pitch. It was a breaking ball, a curveball down. It's right on that line. It's one of those Tristan will look at. He probably thought it was a little low, but not a bad pitch right at the knees. Contreras has his first K. Connor Wong is grounded out to short. Single to deep short, actually off the pitcher's glove, and then single to right. And he tries to check on a high fastball, but he cannot do it in time. Oh, and one. Eight runs, ten hits, an error for the Red Sox. No runs, one hit, just one error for the Buccos. Beautiful PNC Park, the pitch. Swing and a miss. We didn't see a single boat on the Allegheny here. Usually there are many boats going up and down the river, but just threatening rain. and Maybe over the weekend. Yeah, 67 at game time, 58 right now. And cloudy most of the day. 405 start tomorrow, 135 on Sunday. I might see some boating traffic. Yeah. By tomorrow, only 56, though, and Sunday, 53. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> fouled out of play. And I see in Cleveland, we're going to have, uh, I think it's Wednesday night. Temperature will barely reach 45. Ooh. Do we leave the window open for that? No. Okay, just checking. <laughs> just trying to prepare. i got to prepare, right? Exactly. But still, bring your warm threads. The 0-2, top foul by the third base dugout. Oh, Wong and Reese. Both these guys, man, swinging the bats together. They're second in the American League in average. 318 is 19, rather, as a catching tandem. Second in slugging, second in OPS. The two of them together. Remember, early in the year, it was a lot of Reese McGuire was playing more regularly. He was hot. And then they got Wong in there, then he got hot. So it's been kind of going back and forth between these two. Both of them swinging a hot bat. Yeah, it seems like more of a hot bat than the platoon situation. Yeah, nothing to do with righty lefty. 0 2 pitch coming. Contreras deals and he swings and misses. That was a slider away. Probably not a strike. So two out. Lead off man to double still at second. And here comes Yoshida, who had a hit to deep short off the pitcher's glove, struck out looking, and then was hit in the elbow by a pitch. Tomorrow, Cutter Crawford goes against Mitch Keller, another guy the Pirates inked to a long-term contract. He'd be their closest thing they have to an ace. And old friend Martin Perez goes on Sunday. Ball missing low, the lefty. Well, the closest thing 
for now, of course, you got Paul Skeens. And I tell you, when, when I saw Gonzalez go down, I didn't know Priester would be announced. I was thinking maybe Skeens, who was scheduled to pitch last night, would go today. But he ended up throwing three and a third, just shutting down the opponents. Eight Ks. Yep. Something like 34 or 43 pitches were over 100 miles an hour. Yep. Taken low. And he's... The real thing, people are raving about him, but they're yeah. not rushing him. No, 12 and two-thirds and three starts. It's pretty much three, four innings at a whack. I was talking to Derek Shelton before, and said he got up to about 63 pitches. He's like, this is a tough league. They want to make sure that he's ready. Uh, you know, Get his pitch count up to a point where they can control it somewhat and then let him go the rest of the year and not feel like they have to shut him down at some point, right, because the innings. Breaking ball missing inside to Yoshida. Of course, the... You know, manipulating time and contractual years and arbitration and free agency when you're Pittsburgh, it's unfortunately it's something you have to think about. But he could still has a lot to work on. He can just kind of build that count up, and so when he gets up here, you can let him go six, seven innings, twenty-five starts, and not worry about that inning limit. And there's a ball too low. So Yoshida takes a walk. First and second, two down for Dahlbeck, who broke the 0 for 19 and 0 for 33, dating back the last year with a double off the base of the wall in right center. Although Yoshida was thrown out trying to score from first on the play at the plate. And we get a pitching coach visit here. Then he struck out, then he hit a little topper and was thrown out by the pitcher, one to three. We'll check the Subaru of New England scoreboard, the Subaru of New England. Uh, Love Spring event is here. Drive away in a brand new Subaru. Find your authorized Subaru retailer at SubaruofNewEngland.com. Yankees in the Rays, still scoreless in the fifth in the Bronx. Baltimore, Kansas City, 0 0 in the fourth at KC. Cleveland now with a 7 1 lead over Oakland in the fifth. Here's the pitch outside and low. And the Twins lead the Tigers 2-1 to one in Minnesota in the third. It's been a tough stretch for the Twins. Dahlbeck would love an RBI here. The pitch. Fastball high and inside. Throw to second and diving back safely with a hand tag is Ref Snyder. Let's see Ref Snyder getting back. The Red Sox already have... Four guys picked off this year on the bases. That leads Major League Baseball. Just pickoffs, let alone running to some outs. Is that being sleepy or careless? Mm -hmm. A little bit of both. Pitch is taken very high. I think every situation is a little bit different. You know, we mentioned before Reyes getting stuck on that 3 2 2 outs inside move. That's kind of lack of focus, if you ask me, but other times. By the catchers, especially, just really can't let that happen. Got to be more aware. Nice job by Ref Schneider. Here it is, outside. So he walks. Strange inning, a double, two strikeouts, and now two walks, loading him up for him. Manuel Valdez was 0 for 3. You know, it's funny, I was talking to Shelton about Skeens, and he was talking about how hard this league is, and they just. You know, they want to build that pitch count up. He brought up Jackson Holliday, who started his career one for 25. We saw him last week in his debut, and and I sort of laughed and chuckled. I said, yeah, but Skeens throws 102. And he said, yeah, he's really good. Here's a call strike. It'll be here <laughs> before long. Brewers and Cardinals, though, score in the second. Braves two, Rangers one in the bottom of the fourth. Astros lead the Nationals 4-2 in the sixth. Pitch Valdez grounds it foul, first base side. Stay tuned after the game of the Nissan post game show. You deserve a car that thrills you, and Nissan's got an exciting full line that'll put goosebumps on your goosebumps. Shop your local Nissan store at NissanUSAToday.com. 0 2 to Valdez, three on two out the pitch, and a foul. Fisted to the left into the stands. Ref Snyder at third. Yoshida's at second. Dahlback is at first. 
This is the type of hit right here that can really just put this thing away. I mean, it's already 6 nothing. However, you know, blooping a blast. It's 6 to 3, and things start panicking a little bit. But get a little knock here to score two. Break it wide open. Wide open. 0 oh, 2. Swing line drive down the right field line. Fair ball. This could clear the bases. It's rolling all the way to the wall. Two runs have scored. Dahlbeck is being waved home. And here comes the relay to the plate. Chance to get him, and he's tagged out. So the Red Sox lead at 8 0. But they've had two runners thrown out at home plate. That was a little more understandable with yep, two down. That one's better. You force a great relay to get you out at the plate with two outs. That they executed, but still, this one here is understandable with two outs. You take a shot. So Valdez driving in his eighth and ninth runs of the year. And the out at home on Dahlbeck. So after six and a half, it is eight nothing Red Sox in the Shaw's and Star Market, WEEI Red Sox Network. Was that Managing up is exhausting. It's your turn to be the boss. Advance your career with the right degree. As pioneers of online education, UMass Dartmouth Online offers over 20 years of online education experience, one-on-one -on -one faculty support, small class sizes, and professors specifically trained to teach in the online space. Online and continuing education at UMass Dartmouth. You can do this. There are giants among us, and their impact is huge. They are the men and women building and sustaining our Navy's next generation submarines. They are giants in what they do because they work in a place where they can grow, where they can learn the skills to build careers as powerful as the beasts they forge. If you're ready to go big, get on board. We build giants at buildsubmarines.com. Homeowners, listen up. Granite City Electric's decorative lighting showrooms are having a spring sale featuring 15 to 50% off all decorative lighting and clearance items. Stop into any one of Granite City Electric's four convenient showroom locations April 15th through April 20th and save big. Plus, mention this ad and receive an additional 10% off qualifying purchases. You don't want to miss this sale. Go to gcehomelighting.com to learn more. Ask your smart speaker to play 93.7 WEEI. Now back to Red Sox baseball on WEEI. Bayo has departed after six beautiful innings. No runs, a hit, one hit. The double by Sawinski in the opposite field in the second inning. Two walks, seven Ks, 96 pitches, and Chase Anderson takes over. Better than righty, well traveled. Has two saves, both three inning saves and blowout wins. If he goes three innings today, he'll have another one. There's a call strike to the right-hand batting McCutcheon, who struck out looking with two on and two out of the first. And then he grounded it out 5-3. And he grounds this one by the mound. Charged by Raffaella. Gloves. The What an athletic play. Throws him out. Yeah. He went over there the second base bag and made a sidearm throw and got plenty on it. That's the athleticism you're talking about. That, you know, I just don't know if you got anybody that can make that play. Like, he's, he's, he's playing in the hole. This is a slow roller up the middle to the left of second base. Left field side of it. He charges it and in one motion. Just very athletic, strong throw to first. Swinski is the batter. He has their only hit, a double, as we said, in the second inside ball one. You know, a lot of people, when they talk about Rafaela, it's like people don't really know who he is. Like, why would you move him off center? Well, this is a guy that. Swing and a miss. Need. <laughs> well, uh, yeah, need. And I would say two years ago, they weren't really sure if they wanted him at short, they wanted him at second. I mean, center field. But, you know, at the time you had bogey, you had Story coming in. Swinging strike at an inside delivery from Anderson, a cutter at 89. You're looking for center field depth. This is a guy, this is not out of position. This is a guy that can play shortstop at a very high level and center field at a very high level. Outside. And this team needs him at shortstop, which I think he should remain for the rest of the season. If he's going to be a defensive first guy, I want it at that position. Swinging strike. That one disappeared down and away. And Sawinski fans. Good changeup. So Anderson making his fifth appearance. No decisions and an ERA of four with those two saves. He's our blowout closer, Joe. Yeah. Maybe you can get one more here, get up to three. The rule is if you pitch three innings. They don't have to have a one-run lead or three-run lead or the guy on deck uh, is a tying run. 
has finished the game. Here's Triolo. Popped to second and line to second with Valdez making a very nice play. There's a line drive to left field, but right there to make the catch is Abreu for the out. What a quick inning for the veteran Anderson. We go to the eighth. Red Sox leading here. Eight nothing on the Shaws and Star Market. WEEI Red Sox Network. You're dedicated to building. Granite City Electric's decorative lighting showrooms are having a spring sale. Featuring 15 to 50% off all decorative lighting and clearance items. Stop into any one of Granite City Electric's four convenient showroom locations April 15th through April 20th and save big. Plus, mention this ad and receive an additional 10% off qualifying purchases. You don't want to miss this sale. Go to gcehomelighting.com to learn more. There are giants among us. And their impact is huge. They are the men and women building and sustaining our Navy's next generation submarines. They are giants in what they do because they work in a place where they can grow, where they can learn the skills to build careers as powerful as the beasts they forge. If you're ready to go big, get on board. We build giants at buildsubmarines.com. This is a promotional message for Alexia Sweet Potato Fries. And in the process of elucidating you on all the wondrous virtues Alexia Sweet Potato Fries have to offer, I intend to do so in a prodigious manner befitting of such a superlative side. That's because all Alexia creations are creatively crafted, from sweet potato fries that accomplish a delicate balance of sweet and savoury, without GMOs or superfluous additives, to the eloquent lexicon of our advertisements, like this one. Because every Alexia experience is intended to feel creatively crafted and exceptional without exception. Alexia sweet potato fries. Do procure them in your grocer's freezer. This is Alex Cora. You are listening to the home of the Red Sox, WEEI. Hunter Stratton is the next Pittsburgh pitcher. See, Contreras went uh, two innings, allowed a run on two hits, two Ks, two walks. And the first pitch is swung on and missed by Raffaella. It was robbed of it and a great play by the second baseman, but did get an RBI and followed with a stolen base and a force play, grounded a third, and then launched a home run deep into the left field seats. Hunter Stratton misses with that one. One and one. Stratton has been in nine games, 5 4 0 ERA, with one save and a swinging strike. You know, th this is the at bat here. It's eight, no it's eight nothing. Rafaela just sort of in his own little world here, right? Playing good defense after that first inning miscue or second inning miscue. Hit a home run, hit a ball hard. You're sitting here one for three. The two for four, one for four is such a big mental hurdle. Little outside, a close pitch to take. You know, you're able to get one more yeah. knock. Yeah. Big difference. With a home run, it, you. You go into bed, you wake up the next day, and you're kind of trying to get something going. Big difference. And he takes it up and in. Now, one, you're hitting 500. The other, 250. Yeah, you can convince yourself you should have got a knock in the first inning and a beautiful play by Tri uh, Triolo, but still not in the books. 3-2 delivery, and Raffaella pops a foul first base side. Shaw's and Star Market present Norwegian Prime Salmon Fillets, now on sale. Get it today for $8.97 a pound when you use the digital coupon. Shaw's and Star Market, official supermarket of the Red Sox radio network. We're in the eighth, 8 nothing Red Sox. And the pitch is swung on, popped into shallow right field, but circling over to make the catch is Reynolds. So Raffaele is one for four, one down. Stay tuned after the game for the Nissan post-game show. You deserve a car that thrills. Nissan's got an exciting full line that puts goosebumps on your goosebumps. Shop your local Nissan store or go to NissanUSA.com. To the top of the order in Duran, who's 0 for 4, and he takes a ball low. Three ground outs and a pop to short. 
We certainly had a marvelous uh, time today and learned so much more to the Roberto Clemente Museum, which is located in the old firehouse here. Round ball bounce to the second baseman. Triola gloves confidently. Flip short way to first for the out. And uh, Lou, it's, it's just such a marvelous place. You walk in and you see this big photo of Clemente from 1960 at spring training in Fort Myers, Terry Park. And he's leaving his feet to catch a throw or a fly ball. And... Uh, the way the clouds are situated, it looks like he's an angel with wings. Yeah, that was such a great experience to go there for the first time. There's a strike to Abreu. Homer rounded out 3-1, singled and flied the left. Yeah, you learned so much about Roberto Clemente just walking through there. We had spent about an hour outstanding all the information. It's a great place. You come to Pittsburgh, and if you're a baseball fan, you absolutely have, you have to go there. And experience that. You have to go to ClementiMuseum.com to make an appointment. It's not open every day. They have tours scheduled. The 1-1. One, one, swinging a high fly ball. Right center field. Carrying to the track by the wall. And the right fielder jumps. The ball's knocked down. Abreu's at second. Did it bounce over the wall first? Apparently not. It's a two-bagger. There's a yellow line there. It was pretty close to that yellow line. Abreu looking to see if perhaps it'll be reviewed. But there's another ball that looked like it reached the warning track. Yeah, and this one, they got that yellow line. There's the Chick-fil-A pad, and then there's a little fencing in between. So it doesn't get over that yellow line. Looks like it hits just on top of that pad against that fence. Great effort by Reynolds, but Abreu with his third hit of the night. Double, a single, and a home run. Here's Ref Snyder. He's had a home run and a double his last two at-bats. He takes a ball. You know, really, this is your best, not just maybe defensively, but offensively. Getting a Abreu and Rafael at short allows you to have a Abreu in right field or left field. Left field there because it's a bigger park. Left field and right. The pitch home. He's in there for a strike. Ref grounded out 6-3 his first two at-bats, then homer to right center right where the Ball that Abreu almost cleared, and he doubled a left. Red Sox with 12 hits now. That's outside. How about the Clemente contract? And I mean, he was a second-year major leaguer, and he returned the contract to Branch Rickey. It was that whole display of Branch Rickey's contract offer of $7,500. There's a line drive caught by the second baseman, Triolo, nicely. Yeah, we, we got to get into that more because I thought that was the most yeah. fascinating part of the whole museum. It really was. That yeah, was a lot of pride. So that ends the top of the eighth. It's 8 nothing Red Sox and the Shaws in Star Market, WEEI Red Sox Network. There are giants among us, and their impact is huge. They are the men and women building and sustaining our Navy's next generation submarines. They are giants in what they do because they work in a place where they can grow, where they can learn the skills to build careers as powerful as the beasts they forge. If you're ready to go big, get on board. We build giants at buildsubmarines.com. The Namco Pool Splash It to Spring sales event is here. Transform your backyard into a budget-friendly oasis with a remarkable selection of above-ground pools, hot tubs, and patio furniture. Take advantage of pools up to 20% off, jacuzzis up to $1,000 off, and patios up to 56% off. Game and ball. Get in now for the Namco Pool Splash It to Spring sale going on now through the 22nd. Namco Pool, the most trusted pool company for your community. Namcopool.com. You know that Big Bargain detergent jug is 80% water, right? 80% water? If you want a better clean, Tide Pods are only 12% water. The rest is pure, concentrated cleaning ingredients. Ooh, pass me the intercom thing. Attention shoppers. If you want a real deal, try Tide Pods. If it's got to be clean, it's got to be Tide Pods. Water content based on the leading bargain liquid detergent. Save on Tide at Target with a Target gift card. Restrictions apply. Terms and conditions apply to gift cards. For details, go to help.target.com slash help. You're listening to the Sox on the Shaws and Star Market, WEEI, Red Sox Radio Network. Now back to the play-by-play -play action. Jay Sanders and delivers a little ground ball off the bat of Taylor, charged by the third baseman, and Dahlbeck has to put it in his pocket. Once it got by the pitcher, Anderson, there wasn't any chance. So 
Taylor gets just their second hit. A little bleeder down the third base side to the left of the mound. We're talking about Clemente's contract and how he had the guts, I think, to uh, challenge Branch Rickey. Oh, he wrote a letter to Branch Rickey about how he's he feels like after his first year, he's worth more than 7500 He doesn't want to play for less than $10,000 a year. And, you know, he'll wait for his response. And Branch Rickey wrote a three-page letter explaining to him why he's not worth 7500 It was an arbitration case, current-day arbitration case. It was critical of him. Over, yeah, over letters back and forth. Davis, who had a check swing strike, takes a strike now over the outer half, 0-2. Said how we, you know, didn't get on base enough. 255 batting average yeah. is not what we're looking not for. And, power. And then he actually had a math calculation, which actually looked like a slugging percentage, like an analytic. It was pretty funny. Yeah. And uh, eventually he settled for, what, 8,500. Yeah. Take it low for a ball. He signed a Rawlings Gold Glove book contract for a thousand dollars. I just thought it and was. And he got like a what, twenty-five cents if ten cents for every glove that was sold. Five cents if it was the glove was sold on sale. On discount, right? <laughs> <laughs> two and two now to Henry Davis, who's grounded out four three and struck out. Those letters back and forth, like it was just an arbitration case. Why I'm worth it? Why you're not? Yeah, there's a line drive oh. off the glove of the leaping Raffaella in the left field. That'll be hit. That ball took off. Stopping at second base is Taylor. So two on and nobody out. And they have the uh, one of the propellers there from the plane that crashed. Yeah. And the story of that plane never should have been allowed to take off. They said it was uh, overweight with all the supplies that go to Nicaragua. But well, the, the plane had been grounded twice because yeah. of it basically it wasn't functional. And somebody had bought it at a very cheap price, convinced Roberto Clemente that the plane would work, got it to him for a cheap price, to go down to Nicaragua, and the plane just never should have left the ground. The plane actually went into a ditch the week before at San Juan Airport, low and away, damaged the uh, propellers, and the guy who owned it tried to pound it out with a hammer, mm -hmm. which you don't do on magnesium. Pitch is in there for a strike to Cruz is 0 for 3 with a strikeout. You know, that even that base hit by Davis that Rafaela jumps for, I think, you know, just the inexperience hasn't been over there that much this year at all. He trying to almost go up with that second hand, the bare hand. And I can guarantee you, Cora, Andy Fox, Vasquez is going to talk to him about, hey, be athletic, go up there with one hand. You get up there a little bit high, you can reach for it a little bit higher. When that second hand comes in, you can't reach as high as you can with just one. Ball was scalded too. Oh, and one and two now the count to O'Neill Cruz, the six foot seven shortstop. And he swings and does not get an off speed pitch away. A change up, and he's down on strikes. A lot of swing and miss in his game so far this year. That's now 34 strikeouts and 81 at bats. Second for Anderson. Here's Reynolds, has walked twice and struck out. But Roberto, he was, as Dave O'Brien said, that he never took a bad photograph, but he actually went to a professional to learn how to be photographed. Yeah. Because he knew how important those photographs going back to Puerto Rico, you know, would be for that community. And he wanted to make sure that so they told him to lift his hat up. Pitch is swung on and missed. I mean, he was a very handsome guy and a very prideful guy. 5'10", 175 pounds. 38-ounce bat, Joe. Ooh. Held it in my hand. 38 ounces. Swing and a miss. Too bad you're not playing anymore because the other guys who picked up that bat, <laughs> they've had great days right after. There's some uh, karma there. Yeah, 38 ounces. They tell us about Orlando, uh, Oswaldo Cabrera with the Yankees. He picked it up last year. He was in a terrible slump. Had a home run a couple of months. Picked up the bat and hit a bomb the next day. There's a pop-up. Shallow left field could be trouble. Long run, but Abreu was there and makes the catch about 10 feet from the foul line for the out. Runners retreat, so they kept Reynolds quiet. I mean, I, I used to swing a 31 and a half ounce, 32 ounce sometimes. Most guys, I know guys that maybe swing a 35, 33, or 34, 33. And 33, 34 ounces is probably the biggest bat I've known 
Obviously, big boys swinging it, but 38. Man, that thing was a log. Two now for Cabrian. The pitch is a strike over the inside edge. I had the privilege of interviewing Clemente a few times when I worked in Youngstown and come over to Pittsburgh. Very, very serious guy, but very cooperative. Pitch is lined foul, but one day I was in the Pirates Clubhouse at Three Rivers. I think it was 1972, his last year on Earth. And nobody else was in there. He just started talking to me. I didn't have a tape recorder or a camera, but he's telling me about how much pressure he felt in Pittsburgh because everybody wanted him. And when he went home to Puerto Rico, it was 100 times as many. The pitch is swung on, looped down the right field line, but over to make the catch is Ref Snyder. Not far in front of the track for the out that retired. But he was a guy who understood his social responsibility. After eight, eight nothing Red Sox on the Shaw's and Star Market, WEEI Red Sox Network. So, uh, I told him it's in the far end of the dugout. Yeah. Rejuvenate! On your feet, microfiber. Sir, uh, yes, sir. You do realize you're joining a mop 10,000 microfiber strong. And what are we? Powerful and washable and and we have 75% more cleaning pad area, sir. At ease, recruit. Save your strength for dried mud. Rejuvenate, cook and clean. Clean is a powerful thing. Rejuvenate reusable pad cleaning size versus leading competitor pad cleaning size. The Namco Pool Splash It to Spring sales event is here. Transform your backyard into a budget-friendly oasis with a remarkable selection of above-ground pools, hot tubs, and patio furniture. Take advantage of pools up to 20% off, jacuzzis up to $1,000 off, and patios up to 56% off. Get in now for the Namco Pool Splash Into Spring Sale going on now through the 22nd. Namco Pool, the most trusted pool company for your community. Namcopool.com. There are giants among us. They're the men and women building and sustaining our Navy's next generation submarines. If you're ready to go big, get on board. We build giants at buildsubmarines.com. The number one selling product of its kind with over 20 years of research and innovation. Botox Cosmetic, out of botulinum toxin A, is a prescription medicine used to temporarily make moderate to severe frown lines, crow's feet, and forehead lines look better in adults. Effects of Botox Cosmetic may spread hours to weeks after injection, causing serious symptoms. Alert your doctor right away as difficulty swallowing, speaking, breathing, eye problems, or muscle weakness may be a sign of a life-threatening condition. Patients with these conditions before injection are at highest risk. Don't receive Botox Cosmetic if you have a skin infection. Side effects may include allergic reactions, injection site pain, headache, eyebrow and eyelid drooping, and eyelid swelling. Allergic reactions can include rash, welts, asthma symptoms, and dizziness. Tell your doctor about medical history, muscle or nerve conditions including ALS or Lou Gehrig's disease, myasthenia gravis, or Lambert-Eaton syndrome and medications, including botulinum toxins, as these may increase the risk of serious side effects. For full safety information, visit BotoxCosmetic.com or call 877-351-0300. See for yourself at BotoxCosmetic.com. Red Sox review after the game on 93.7 WEEI. Now it's with a swing and a miss as we go to the ninth inning. Under Stratton still pitching. He allowed a double, but no runs in his only inning of work. The eighth. Casas had a long home run in the first to left center. Fourth and seven games. Sixth of the year. He's walked. Applied to center. Struck out looking. The right-hander works. And a top ground ball hit to the first baseman. Roddy Telez will do it himself for the out. As we reported just before, we, just after we went on the air today, David McCarty, who played for the Red Sox, it was back at Fenway Park for the 04 reunion just 10 days ago, passed away suddenly in Oakland, California, a cardiac event. Yeah, Dave Ball was blown away. Great guy. Dave was a great guy. Uh, Quiet Stanford grad. Yep, yeah, was with him in that old three team. Kind of roll guy. Big dude. Big power. Got a right through left pitch for the Red Sox in 04 early in the season. The home opener, in fact. It's just it's unbelievable. I mean, he was just at Fenway opening day. Saw him there. 54 years old. Wife's two kids. Yeah. Life. 
an author, a writer. Daughter just graduated from Oxford. Pitched low and inside. They was a native of Houston. Came up with the Twins. Of several clubs, including the Red Sox, where he was so well respected. Kevin Euclid told me he was great to the young players, mm -hmm. especially those guys who weren't playing every day. 2 1 pitch, swinging strike by Wong, who has two singles, grounded a short, and a strikeout. Looks like we can get a major league debut here in the ninth. Joe Hamboozer, he's up it. in that Sox bullpen. It'll be fun to see. Pitch is a little bit low, one out, nobody on. And Roberto Clemente gave so much to his life, and he had all these premonitions. His brother died at 38 on New Year's Eve. Same thing happened, of course, with the plane crash that night. Followed to the right out of play. I'll never forget, I was doing the all-night show at a radio station in Cleveland, New Year's Eve, because I worked when people wanted to be off. And uh, I was standing at the teletype and watching as the story came in, as they were typing the old UPI machine. And it was just so tragic, shocking. Swing and a miss, long fans. Well, the real scary thing is, as you mentioned, like he, his brother passed away on New Year's Eve at 38 years old. And Roberto always, I guess, had this premonition that he would die on New Year's Eve at 38 in a plane crash in a plane yeah. crash and that his body would never be found and <laughs> his buddy Manny Sanguia went diving for it uh, for about a week off the coast of Puerto Rico off San Juan and it was never found but if you had that premonition would you jump on a plane New Year's Eve at 38 when you've been thinking it like your whole life it's like I wouldn't even mess with that you know let's just go tomorrow we'll just we'll, we'll wait well, he was so determined because the dictator there had been intercepting some of the supplies in Nicaragua. He wanted to make sure that it got there. Ground ball by Yoshida, throw to first by the third baseman, retires him a 1-2-3 inning. And that is just the second time the Red Sox have gone in order. Bottom of the ninth, Red Sox lead at 8-0 on the Shaws and Star Market, WEEI Red Sox Network. There are giants among us and their impact is huge. They are the men and women building and sustaining our Navy's next generation submarines. They are giants in what they do because they work in a place where they can grow, where they can learn the skills to build careers as powerful as the beasts they forge. If you're ready to go big, get on board. We build giants at buildsubmarines.com. Set yourself up for success sooner than later. After graduation, when I got my first official full-time job, I realized punctuality is imperative. It wasn't until I was a parent when I realized being reliable is critical. I'm pretty sure it wasn't until I retired when I realized how essential it is to be health conscious. Steve Lewis and Company. Invest with confidence. Helping you plan a brighter future. Ask your smart speaker to play 93.7 WEEI. Now back to Red Sox baseball on WEEI. Boozer about ready to throw his first major league pitch, and it swung on and lined the left field. Long run for Abreu. Dives can't get it. It goes to the wall on a hop, and Williams, the pinch hitter, hits second. He's on his way to third, and he's going to make it easily. The ball rattled around with the wall rounds out. So Akil Williams with a booming double. Abreu, I don't think he had a great chance to catch that ball. But it goes as a double and a triple, rather. As Alika Williams pinch hitting, triples to left field. Cam Boozer, 31-year-old rookie. The guy we were talking about earlier, throws 97 to 99 with his fastball at Preston Spring Training. Played pro ball, quit for four years, came back with the Chicago Dog, managed by Butch Hobson, who told us all about him today. He, you got to be uh, like you found a pot of gold, an independent ball, to get a guy that throws that hard. Give me a lefty throw 97, 98. Wow. He's going to touch 99 at times, too. Unbelievable story here. McCutcheon swings and misses. That's a good slider at 87 years old. So 
Kim Boozer, just talk about injury after injury. Tommy John, college, torn labrum, he fractured a vertebrae, broke his leg. This is all these injuries that have happened in a three-year, four-year span. Swing and a miss. One of his favorites is Alan Embry. You were with him as I was at fantasy camp, and uh, Embry coached him at Bend, Oregon. Yeah. So in 2016, he was rehabbing a shoulder surgery down in Fort Myers, and his neighbor went to the winter meetings and wanted him to go over and watch his dogs. It's a pitch inside and high to McCutcheon. While rehabbing, after going over there, he rode his bike. And while riding his bike home, he got hit by a car and yeah. broke his back. And pretty much just called it quits. Like, just can't do it anymore. Injury after injury. Four-year span before he threw a baseball. Working on ceiling tiles as a carpenter. Swing and a miss. And McCutcheon fans, there's his first major league strikeout. So Boozer, after the triple, strikes out the veteran McCutcheon. Yeah. He said after a four-year span working with kids, he started jumped on the mound for the first time in 2021, February 2021. It was the first time he'd thrown a baseball without pain. And it was 98. And said, huh, I'm going to give this thing a shot again. Here he is at 31 years old in the big leagues. Edward Oliveras pinch hitting now for Stawanski. Grounds it to third. Dahlbeck to let the run score as he throws the first for the out. So that breaks up the shutout. Eight to one Red Sox. I mean, this is like the... Was it Dennis Quaid in the movie The Rookie? Yeah. Who just, you know. The left-hand pitcher <laughs> with Tampa Bay. Yeah. But, and he was, it was something else, too. He, he struck out 15 of the 25 guys he faced down in Worcester. And I talked to people down there, and they said, this dude's just in the wrong league. Walked one guy. He was just punching everybody out. Just in the wrong league. Just the one where he should be. So two down. Here's Triolo. Grounds it by the mound. Goes to the second baseman. Valdez flips the first. Ball game over. The Red Sox win the first game of this series 8-1. to one. Boozer getting high five in his major league debut. Did give up a run, but made quick work of the Pirates, as did all the Red Sox pitchers today, the three of them. The win goes to Brian Bayo. The Red Sox hit four home runs and roll here tonight. Eight to one, Boston. They stay over 500 at 11 and 10. Totals next on the Shaws and Star Market, WEI Red Sox Network. Subtle results, still you, but with fewer lines. Botox Cosmetic, out of botulinum toxin A, is a prescription medicine used to temporarily make moderate to severe frown lines, crow's feet, and forehead lines look better in adults. Effects of Botox Cosmetic may spread hours to weeks after injection, causing serious symptoms. Alert your doctor right away as difficulty swallowing, speaking, breathing, eye problems, or muscle weakness may be a sign of a life-threatening condition. Patients with these conditions before injection are at highest risk. Don't receive Botox Cosmetic if you have a skin infection. Side effects may include allergic reactions, injection site pain, headache, eyebrow and eyelid drooping, and eyelid swelling. Allergic reactions can include rash, welts, asthma symptoms, and dizziness. Tell your doctor about medical history, muscle or nerve conditions including ALS or Lou Gehrig's disease, Myasthenia gravis or Lambert-Eaton syndrome and medications, including botulinum toxins, as these may increase the risk of serious side effects. For full safety information, visit BotoxCosmetic.com or call 877-351-0300. See for yourself at BotoxCosmetic.com. There are giants among us. They are the men and women building and sustaining our, our Navy's next generation submarines. If you're ready to go big, get on board. We build giants at buildsubmarines.com. Planet Oat Oat Milk is so rich and creamy. I love it in my cereal, but also in smoothies. With zero grams of sugar in Planet Oat unsweetened varieties. But it gets even better. It's an excellent source of calcium with vitamins A and D that's delicious in everything. Mmm, including my lattes. Pick up the carton that has it all. Or visit planetout.com for more. Planet Oat. Be good to you. This is the Nissan Post Game Show. At Nissan, we make cars that thrill. Experience the thrill for yourself. Shop NissanUSA.com. Welcome back to PNC Park. Beautiful park in Pittsburgh where the Red Sox have rolled to an 8-1 to win. And with us is a guy who had three extra base hits. A long home run to get the Red Sox started in the first. And two booming doubles. Will you rebray you? Well, your congratulations. Uh, you were really swinging great tonight. 
What did you feel? Uh, I mean, I feel good today. Uh, do some adjustment. So I start to do like land a little early, yeah. so that I can see the ball better, and I feel better today. So, William, we want to know, has anybody told you if that ball made it to the river or not? Because you <laughs> smoked that thing in the first. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> it, was, it was a good one, but nobody told me nothing about that yet. So, we'll I don't know. We'll find out. We'll find out. Yeah. But well, you can do it tomorrow, right? <laughs> oh, yeah, maybe, hopefully. <laughs> hey, I, I wanted to ask you about playing. You played a lot of right field. Today you go out there in left field. Is it? Is that is that difficult, or is it just understanding the spin of the baseball is a little bit different off the bat? Uh, a little bit, just, I mean, I've even played a lot of left field through my career, and last year I played a lot of left field, so I feel comfortable too, and just, you know, stay, stay focused, because this year I've been playing more right field, but I think it's not a big difference for me, so. What adjustment did you make at home plate? Well, like I said before, uh, I start a little early. Start early? Uh, yeah, and stay like stable with my body under control and see, and see, you know, like I can see the ball better and all that stuff. Well, that's, I would say stay with that adjustment and just keep doing what you're doing. Yeah, I after think, tonight. <laughs> thank you, thank you. <laughs> Well, you're certainly getting a chance to play every day, and I think you've been a little more aggressive. I know you know the strike zone well, but you've been uh, a little more aggressive, right, swinging? Yeah, because, you know, everybody knows that I'm very patient about the play, so uh, I recognize that the pitchers start to, like, attack me early, so just make that adjustment, try to be more aggressive early in the count, and you know, the, the result is right there. Well, you what a great outing from your guy, Brian Bayo. Uh, just just what really you guys needed. He was fantastic tonight. What did you see? Yeah, he was great. He was great. He was executing all the, all his pitches uh, through, you know, pitching to the edges. And I think it was a good day for him. So he deserved it. Well, we, we love the way you're swinging the bat. We love to watch you play the outfield, too. And... Uh, Congratulations and continued success. Yeah, thank you so much, guys. William Abreu, who's from Venezuela, and... Uh, you know, the whole time, I'm glad he said that, too, because the whole time, he, you knew there was just something mechanical off, right? Talking to Fatsy and Rosie and Louis Ortiz, like, it was just, it's there, right? We know yeah. it's there. We saw it last year. There was so much swing and miss on fastballs in the zone that it's not what we had seen, and you knew that it was just a little mechanical thing, whether it's body, timing, whatever it may be, and... It's kind of just a matter of time before you kind of see that guy come back to what we saw last year, and it started here tonight. So the totals, eight runs, 12 hits, one error, seven left for Boston, one run, four hits, one error, six left for the Pirates. The Red Sox hit four home runs. Abreu with a tremendous homer in the first inning, his first of the season. And then uh, Ref Snyder, the two-run bomb in the fifth inning, his first on the first uh, swing, first pitch of that inning. Of course, Casas hit another one in the first inning, his sixth, with the bases empty. And uh, Raffaella, his first home run, and that came in the sixth inning with the bases empty. Two hours, 22 minutes of time of game, watched by 17,959. And our flex play of the game would have to be the Abreu home run because that's what got the Red Sox off and running. If you're looking to buy a car this year, try Flex Car instead. Flex Car's monthly car subscription includes insurance, maintenance, roadside assistance, and more. Get started today at flexcar.com. Well, tomorrow the Red Sox will try to make it two in a row as uh, they will send Cutter Crawford to the mound against Mitch Keller, the Pirates' ace. A little very good night. Way to start the trip. Red Sox 8-3 and three on the road. Can they stay on the road? <laughs> Played a lot better baseball on the road. This was this was a good one. Of course, you know, it was really set by the starter, Brian Bay, who was fantastic. Six innings, one hit. No earned runs, two walks, seven strikeouts. Got better, it seemed like, as the game kind of went on. His changeup was a difference maker today. It was fantastic. It's usually pretty good. Tonight, it was very good, and that was exactly what they needed. Yes, it was. So, the Red Sox now 11-10, and 10, and we'll be back with you tomorrow for a 4-10 start here at PNC Park.
Stay tuned for the post-game show in the Shaw's and Star Market, WEEI Red Sox Network. There are giants among us. They are the men and women building and sustaining our Navy's next generation submarines. If you're ready to go big, get on board. We build giants at buildsubmarines.com. Take a minute to check your social battery. How's it doing? It's easy to ignore our needs and spread ourselves too thin. Therapy can give you the self-awareness to build a social life that doesn't drain your battery. BetterHelp offers affordable online therapy on a schedule that works for you. Start the process in minutes and switch therapists anytime. Find your social sweet spot with BetterHelp. Visit BetterHelp.com grow today to get 10% off your first month. That's BetterHelp, H-E-L-P dot com slash grow. Sox fans, the boys of summer are back, and the future is here. Haas has absolutely obliterated that ball. Jared Duran leading off with a home run. With the free Odyssey app, you can catch every Devers blast with Hall of Fame Joe on the call. Up another opposite field home run for Rafi Devers. Your soundtrack to summer is on Boston Sports Original with every Sox game live on the Odyssey app with WEEI. Download it today. A-U-D-A-C-Y. Live games available for fans in market only. Add some sizzle to your next special occasion with the Kansas City Steak Company. The most tender, world-class premium steaks delivered right to your door. Get 15% off plus free shipping right now at KansasCitySteaks.com. Use promo code DR15. Oh boy, your front door looks like this. When it could look like this. We're right window and door. A new front door is an amazing thing. The right one improves the entire look of your house. And at right window and door, we make sure you get the right one. We come over with this fancy schmancy software, sit down at your dining room table, and match a ton of door styles to a pick of your house. You swipe right through them. No, no. Ooh, I like that. That wood is good. Add glass, remove the brass, customize it right on the spot. Done. It's like a dating app for doors. Only better than a dating app because when you finally meet the door it actually looks like the picture eh. right now save three hundred dollars on door installation with free financing for 18 months so make an appointment with right window because your house will be closer to perfect when you match it with the perfect front door call right window right now call 800-649-3600 quality products professionally installed for the right price right window and door Ask your smart speaker to play 93.7 WEEI. Now back to Red Sox baseball on WEEI. The Red Sox are back above 500. They defeat the Pittsburgh Pirates 8-1 to in Pittsburgh. The Sox now 11-10 overall in the season. And how about this? On the road, 8-3. and So they did go 3-7 and in their opening homestand, but they're playing well away from Fenway Park. And this one really from the get-go, was all Red Sox. They got two runs in the first inning on two home runs. First, it was William Abreu, and then Tristan Casas going deep. They led the rest of the way. Brian Bayo, awesome in this one as well. He went six innings and allowed just one hit. Did not allow a run. Struck out uh, Struck out seven. It walked just two. You're listening to the Nissan Post Game Show. You deserve a car that thrills you. And Nissan's got an exciting full line that'll put goosebumps on your goosebumps. Shop your local Nissan store and Nissan USA Dot com today. Joe Wild with you here at the WEI Red Sox Studios. Again, the final Red Sox 8, Pirates 1. The Arbella Insurance Foundation is dedicated to striking out cancer by supporting the Jimmy Fund. And tonight, Red Sox pitchers had 10 strikeouts, and that means another $500 to the Jimmy Fund to help strike out cancer. Arbella, here for the Jimmy Fund, here for good. As I mentioned, Brian Bayo, seven strikeouts, and then Chase Anderson had two and two shutout innings, and Cam Booser making his major league debut at age 31. He also picked up a strikeout, and how about your first punch out in the big leagues being against Andrew McCutcheon, a former MVP award winner, uh, back with the Pirates in his first stint with Pittsburgh, now in his second stint with the Pirates, but Cam Booser uh, ends up tossing an inning in his major league debut debut closing this one out he did allow one hit and one run but that is not the point the point is a man who's gone through so much and we'll get into it in Red Sox review made his major league debut and ended up 
closing out an 8-1 to Red Sox win to get them to 11-10 and on the season. For every double the Red Sox hit, we'll donate $50 to the American Diabetes Association, brought to you in part by the Massachusetts Health Connector. If you need health insurance, go to mahealthconnector.org and find the right plan for you and your family. So the Red Sox ended up hitting four doubles today. Rob Refsnyder with one. Bobby Dahlbeck on the board in the hit column. He ended up hitting a double in this one. So did Manuel Valdez and Will Your Abreu. So four doubles for the Red Sox. That means $200 to the American Diabetes Association. And for every four-bagger the Red Sox hit this season, the Red Sox Radio Network will donate $40 to Cars for Kids. We are making our donation. You should, too. Call one eight seven seven cars for kids or go to carsforkids.com to donate your card today. That's cars with a K. And the Red Sox had four home runs today. And, and the Red Sox offensively, they've had their struggles this year, but they did come into today tied for third in Major League Baseball with 24 home runs. So they're up to 28 now on the season. The players to go deep, Rob Ref Snyder, Tristan Casas, Sadon Rafaela hitting his first home run of the season along with Rob Ref Snyder. And then this guy, Will Urbreu, who got the scoring going in the first inning with that bomb. So again, the Red Sox, an 8-1 to one winner today over the Pittsburgh Pirates. You're listening to the Nissan Postgame Show. You deserve a car that thrills you, and Nissan's got an exciting full line that'll put goosebumps on your goosebumps. Shop your local Nissan store and NissanUSA.com today. Back with more of the Nissan Postgame Show right after this along the Shaw's and Star Market. WEEI Red Sox Network. There are giants among us. They are the men and women building and sustaining our Navy's next generation submarines. If you're ready to go big, get on board. We build giants at buildsubmarines.com. Take a minute to check your social battery. How's it doing? It's easy to ignore our needs and spread ourselves too thin. Therapy can give you the self-awareness to build a social life that doesn't drain your battery. BetterHelp offers affordable online therapy on a schedule that works for you. Start the process in minutes and switch therapists anytime. Find your social sweet spot with BetterHelp. Visit BetterHelp.com grow today to get 10% off your first month. That's BetterHelp, hel dot grow. Sox fans, the boys of summer are back, and the future is here. Casas absolutely obliterated that ball. Jared Duran leading off for the home run. With the free Odyssey app, you can catch every Devers blast with Hall of Fame Joe on the call. Up another opposite field home run for Rafi Devers. Your soundtrack to summer is on Boston's Sports Original with every Sox game live on the Odyssey app with WEEI. Download it today. A-U-D-A-C-Y. Live games available for fans in market only. Add some sizzle to your next special occasion with the Kansas City Steak Company. The most tender, world-class premium steaks delivered right to your door. Get 15% off plus free shipping right now at KansasCitySteaks.com. Use promo code DR15. Get ready. The biggest sale in the history of Rent-A-Center is here. From April 14th to April 20th, take 50% off everything in the store or online and get our biggest savings ever. 50% off offer reduces the total amount necessary to acquire ownership or sue to rental purchase agreement. Offer valid on new agreements entered into April 14th, 2024 through April 20th, 2024. Participating locations only. Homeowners, listen up. Granite City Electric's decorative lighting showrooms are having a spring sale featuring 15 to 50% off all decorative lighting and clearance items. Stop into any one of Granite City Electric's four convenient showroom locations April 15th through April 20th and save big. Plus, mention this ad and receive an additional 10% off qualifying purchases. You don't want to miss this sale. Go to gcehomelighting.com to learn more. Imagine the marketing magic you could bring to life with nothing holding you back. If the data you needed was always within reach. If you could build any segment quickly. If you could engage customers on every channel. What would be possible if you could create without constraints? With Bloomreach, your marketing has no limits. Build the campaign you've always dreamed of and the ones you haven't thought up yet, all from a single platform. Bloomreach. Be limitless. You're listening to the Sox on the Shaws and Star Market, WEEI Red Sox Radio Network. Now, back to the play-by-play action. 
And you're listening to the Nissan Post Game Show. You deserve a car that thrills you, and Nissan's got an exciting full line that'll put goosebumps on your goosebumps. Shop your local Nissan store or and NissanUSA.com today. Joe Weil with you here in the WEEI Red Sox studios as the Red Sox beat the Pittsburgh Pirates 8-1 to at PNC Park. So the Sox now 11-10 overall in the season and 8-3 and on the road. Time now for the Subaru of New England scoreboard. The Subaru of New England Love Spring event is here. Drive away in a brand new 2024 Subaru. Find your authorized Subaru retailer at Subaru of New England. Com. We'll start in the American League East. The Yankees jumped out ahead against the Rays thanks to a five-run bottom of the seventh inning. So the Yankees lead the Rays at Yankee Stadium 5-1. to one. Anthony Volpe hit a go-ahead RBI single, and then Juan Soto hit a three-run home run after that to cap off the inning. So again, Yankees 5, Rays 1, top of the eighth inning with runners at second and third, and nobody out. Elsewhere around the division, Baltimore trailing Kansas City 1-0, Baltimore's playing on the road in this one. It's in the bottom of the sixth inning. Vinny Pasquantino hit a solo home run for the Royals in the bottom of the fourth inning. Royals are actually 12-7 and seven this season. The O's are 12-6. and six. They came in a half game back of the Yankees for the top spot in the division. And then Toronto's playing on the road against the Padres in San Diego. That one will get going at 940. Other finals around Major League Baseball. Philadelphia 7-0 winner over the Chicago White Sox. Alec Bohm hit two three-run home runs in this one. Won. The White Sox now a paltry 3-16 and 16 now overall in the season. Cincinnati a 7-1 win over the Los Angeles Angels as Ellie De La Cruz went 2-4 for four in this one. He ended up stealing three bases, also hit a home run in this contest as well. Other finals around Major League Baseball, Cubs an 8-3 winner over the Miami Marlins. Jamison Tyone, five innings pitch, three hits, one earned run allowed, one run allowed overall. And four strikeouts, the Cubs led 7 to nothing after three in that one, so they jumped out early and took full command. Games in progress, the Astros ahead 5-2 to two over the Washington Nationals. That is in the nation's capital, of course, a rematch of the 2019 World Series. One of the holdovers from that World Series was on the mound for the Astros, Justin Verlander. He's in line for the win. He allowed just two runs in six innings of work. The Guardians, who are in first place in the AL Central, and of course just won a series against the Red Sox at Fenway Park. They're up 10-2 to in the top of the ninth inning against the Oakland Athletics. The Braves have a 7-3 lead over the Rangers in the bottom of the seventh inning. A career night for Travis Darno. He's 3-3 three for three with three home runs. He had a grand slam in this one that gave the Braves the lead in this contest. So they're on top by four in the bottom of the seventh. Again, seven to three, the score there. The Detroit Tigers have a three to two lead over the Twins in Minnesota. That's through five innings. And then the Brewers have a one nothing advantage against the Cardinals in St. Louis. Top five in that contest between those two NL Central teams. And then the other games to be up on the slate coming up. The Dodgers are at home against the Mets. That's a 10-10 start time. The Mets all of a sudden, they've been playing some pretty good baseball. They've won six out of their last seven games, and this should be a fun one with Yoshinobu Yabamoto on the mound for the Dodgers. And then the final game I haven't mentioned, it's the Giants versus the D-backs, and it's two guys on the mound that are getting starts that are were Scott Boris clients in the offseason that had to wait a long time to get signed. It's Blake Snell and Jordan Montgomery going head-to-head in this contest at Oracle Park at 10-15. One game got washed out today. That was between the Seattle Mariners and the Colorado Rockies. They're making that up Sunday in a doubleheader. Tonight's Mike's amazing player of the game. There, there's so many different candidates, and on any other night, we would give it to somebody like Brian Bayo who went six shutout innings and allowed just one hit, or somebody like William Brayu who went three for five, or Rob Ruff Snyder, who also hit a home run. There were four guys that hit home runs today. I have to give it to Cam Booster, though. He made his major league debut at age 31. It's such a cool story. He was out of the game for a long time, came back, and worked his way to the major leagues through injuries, so much adversity. Got to give it to him, even though he gave up a run in one inning of work, but it's his major league debut, struck out a batter, and it was Andrew McCutcheon, who at one point was one of the best players in major league baseball. So Cam Booster, tonight's Mike's Amazing Player of the Game, brought to you by Mike's Amazing, the official mayo and mustard of the Boston Red Sox. And fans, don't forget to tune in to the Mass Mutual Red Sox pregame show tomorrow at 3.05. Talk to Mass Mutual today. Feel comfortable about tomorrow. And on the bump for the Red Sox in that contest will be Cutter Crawford, who will enter with no record. So, oh, no. But he has an 0.42 ERA. He's been... 
fantastic on the mound for the Red Sox this year, and he will be opposite of Mitch Keller in that contest at PNC Park. It'll be a 4.05 first pitch. And again, the Mass Mutual Red Sox pregame show will get going at 3.05. Again, the final today from PNC Park in Pittsburgh. Red Sox 8, Pirates 1. Want to thank Joe Castiglione and Lou Merloni for a great call today. Stiz back here at the flagship behind the glass doing fantastic work all night long. I'm Joe Weil saying so long here as the Red Sox win it 8-1 to one against the Pirates. If you're listening on the network, it's really a so long. But if you're listening locally on... WEI 93.7. Don't go anywhere. Red Sox Review is coming up next. You have been listening to the Nissan Post Game Show. At Nissan, we make cars that thrill. Experience the thrill for yourself. Shop NissanUSA.com. You have been listening to Red Sox Baseball on the Shaws and Star Market WEEI Red Sox Radio Network. The Red Sox on WEEI are brought to you by Shaws and Star Market, perfecting the art of fresh. Holy cow! 110 Grill, gluten-free dining done right. Arbella, here for baseball fans, here for good. Brought to you by Azek Exteriors. Visit www.azekexteriors.com. Mike's Amazing, the official Official mayo and mustard of the Boston Red Sox. And it's gone! Sitco. When you start with Sitco, you're good to go. Sponsored by DigSafe. Call 811 before you dig or visit digsafe.com. Drains by James. Eastern Massachusetts leader in drain cleaning and pipelining. And that ball is gone into the front row of the monster seats. Herb Chambers. At Herb Chambers, we don't sell cars. We help people buy them. Morgan and Morgan. Injured? Hire Morgan and Morgan. America's largest injury law firm. Cars for kids. Old car giving you problems? Why not donate it? Call 1-877-CARS-4-KIDS today. Northern Bank. New England Ford. Ford Trucks. Official truck of the Boston Red Sox. Looking up. Sponsored by Sherwin-Williams. The Sherwin-Williams Pro Plus program helps you manage and grow your paint business. Sponsored by Nissan. At Nissan, we make cars that thrill. Experience the thrill for yourself. Shop NissanUSA.com. Town Fair Tire. Nobody beats Town Fair Tire. Nobody. We're going to drive the left field power a couple runs. Subaru of New England. Love spring in the all-wheel drive 2024 Subaru Forester. Verizon, the network Boston relies on. Long gone into the monster seats. This has been a presentation of Odyssey Sports. For even more coverage of your team, download the free Odyssey app and listen to your favorite stations, shows, and podcasts. Thanks for listening to this Red Sox broadcast. For more Sox coverage and analysis across all of baseball, check out the Baseball Isn't Boring podcast with me, Rob Bradford. Follow Baseball Isn't Boring on the Odyssey app or wherever you get your podcasts. Channel your automotive passion into a rewarding career path. Whether you're a seasoned pro or just starting fresh, your local car star has a variety of opportunities to join this elite premier collision repair company. Get your foot on the gas and race to success with a career at CarStar. Explore the endless possibilities and visit CarStarJobs.com to learn more about how we drive excellence together. That's CarStarJobs.com. Start your journey with us today. At Enterprise, we know you're constantly on the move. Getting this. Thanks, Mom. Fixing that. You reach a destination. And then it's on to the next. And when life is moving at the speed of, well, life, Enterprise is right there with you, around the corner and around the globe. We'll keep you moving forward. Enterprise, for lives in drive. Take a minute to check your social battery. How's it doing? It's easy to ignore our needs and spread ourselves too thin. Therapy can give you the self-awareness to build a social life that doesn't drain your battery. BetterHelp offers affordable online therapy on a schedule that works for you. Start the process in minutes and switch therapists anytime. Find your social sweet spot with BetterHelp. Visit BetterHelp.com slash grow today to get 10% off your first month. That's BetterHelp, H-E-L-P dot com slash grow. 
Sox fans, the boys of summer are back, and the future is here. Haas has absolutely obliterated that ball. Jared Duran leading off with a home run. With the free Odyssey app, you can catch every Devers blast with Hall of Fame.